have here a caller. Let me see who is this call and hold on. Hello? Yes. How are you? Wa alaikum assalam. Wa alaikum assalam. So are you still live right now? I'm still live. People are hearing you, my friend. What do you want to say to us? Hey. Well, uh, first I want to <laughs> greet everyone with peace and blessings from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, our God, our creator. Mm -hmm. And uh, I do want to say that I do bear witness that there's no God other than Allah, and I bear witness that Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, is his final servant and seal of all prophets. Not sure how you witness. <laughs> how, what do you mean by I witness? I bear witness. You know what that means. It means that I, I declare... And no, so from the jump, let's not let's not play play games, okay? Well, I'm not, I'm not playing. I'm asking you a question. Don't go aggressive. Right. Take it easy, because the well, word in well, Arabic. What is the word witness in Arabic? The one it's used in the Shahada. That that's la ilaha illallah. No, 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 no. Before you say the ilaha illallah, what do you say? What do you mean? You say ashhadu, correct? Yeah, what ashadu mean? That's that's look, see what you're trying to do already is you're trying to my friend, I'm to, I'm just asking create, you, don't create, tell me what I'm trying to what, what no I, need for why you are telling me I'm trying, trying to do. You don't even know what I'm saying. Why why you wanna do what the word ashadu mean? Ashadu mean doesn't mean I declare, it's mean I witness. And I asked you what what do you mean I witness? So how you witness and you are not a witness. So Allah is Allah is using so if Allah is using Allah is using the wrong, you don't want to admit that Allah is using the wrong word. Anyway, continue. <laughs> that that's a that's a, a very uh, ignorant thing to say. Why so, do you speak Arabic? Um, do you speak Arabic? Do you speak Arabic? Let's, let's do you speak ahead. do you speak Arabic? How no, I am I'm ignorant. Scared. You are the one who do not know I'm Arabic. Scared. So how do you want to teach me Arabic? Ashadu mean I, I Ashadu I mean I witness what, and you are the one who said that I witness right. not declare you are the one who said that so how you witness but you are not a witness this is the game you play see what what it boils down to is you're trying to twist and turn things and you know good <laughs> well, good and well All right. it means that Continue. I'm listening I'm listening after you witness why why yeah. you are witnessing for us that Allah is God and Muhammad is a prophet and we know your name is a Muslim and you are a Muslim what what is the point of saying right. I witness there's no God but Allah do you know it's that? Just, is it true that Allah Himself? Is it true? Faith, listen, listen, listen. Mujahid, Mujahid. Is it true that Allah Himself He converted to Islam and He said Shahada? That Allah converted to Islam. Yeah. That's a foolish thing to say. Really? What if that's I show it to you from the Quran? That's a foolish thing to say. Okay, read for me chapter three, verse number eighteen. <laughs> you read it to me. No, you read it. You are the Muslim. I, you told me where. You, I'm, I'm showing you. You read it. Chapter three, verse no. number eighteen. It says no. Allah. Allah, he said shahada. Allah said, Shahid Allah, Shahid Allah, Shahid Allah, Shahid Allah, and the ilaha illa huwa. How that happened? How Allah witnessed that there is no. It's this what it says in front of your eyes. My, my friend, it is in the front of your eyes. What kind of God? What kind of God he takes shahada? You want to talk about issues? Uh, yeah, uh, your God voice doesn't take shahada. Okay, so read it. Period. It says, Shahid Allahu annahu la ilaha illallah illahu. Uh, my friend, do you see the word shahida? That's your ignorance. You don't know Arabic. That is your. So, okay, listen, listen. So don't discuss with me something you do not know. What do you, okay, let me let us make it simple. I want you to prove to me that Islam is a from from the true God. Can we do that? Mujahid. Absolutely. Okay, go ahead. Absolutely. I'm, I'm listening. Okay, so what, what, let's go ahead and establish some ground rules because I'm not going to play your games, you know, the, the, the games that you persistently play mm -hmm. where you try to you try to twist and turn things mm -hmm. and you try to change the subject, mm -hmm. you try to redirect, you use mm -hmm. red herrings, mm -hmm. you, you know, it's, it's constant with you. You're, mm -hmm. you're very simple to figure out. You're really? very, very... <laughs> Let us see how good uh, you are. Let us see how good you are. As long as you know how simple I am to figure out, but, let us see how good you are. So go straight to the topic. I, Don't waste my time. Am, how you can prove to me that Allah is the true God? Go ahead. I'm listening. I'm listening. Very simple. How? Very simple. How? It's, it's a declaration of faith. For one, we believe in what we cannot see. Okay? And if you are incapable of doing that, then you're incapable of, of believing in the oxygen that you breathe. You cannot see the oxygen that you breathe. But you most certainly do breathe it. Each I, I don't know how smart you are. I'm asking you how to prove to me that Allah is a true God. You say to me you to believe in the unseen. 
Well, we are not atheists, my friend. We believe in God. When we don't see him, this is a stupid answer. Right. I'm saying to you, answer me. How you can prove to me that Allah is a true God and Muhammad is a true prophet? Don't tell me we don't believe we believe in the unseen. All people who have religion, they believe in the unseen. This is not the question. This is not the topic. You are playing around. Speak straight as an adult. How you prove to me that Allah is a true God? What is your proof? What is your proof that he is not? Because he says stupid things. As an example, in the Quran, he says that the, the, the sperm of the women came in from the ribs. Brother, if you would, if you understood the scientific... Uh, My friend, this is a scientific... Uh, here we go. In the front of me. In the front of me. If you would realize... My friend, it's in the front of me. Chapter 86. Chapter 86, verse number 7. This is Quran. Allah, he says that women, she have a sperm. It's coming from her ribs. Have you ever heard of somebody saying such a thing? Absolutely. What Absolutely. As a matter of fact, let me get something real quick, and I'm going to read it to you. Okay. And then you'll have a full understanding. And this is from a doctor who's actually done research on this. Mm -hmm. And if you bear with me just one second, because I didn't anticipate going into this. No uh, problem. This, the doctor, he said that women, she have a sperm uh, coming from her ribs. Doctors, they say that. But what, what, you, what you do need to do mm -hmm. is you do need to stay on your toes with me. Because uh, this this tactic that you're using to trying to bounce around and and uh, go to different topics. My friend, go straight uh, to the topic. Don't tell me you, you are the one. Is, you see why? Right, why you need to give me 15 right, minutes speech? Why you need to give me the 15? Go straight to the topic. Show me the doctor who said that women they have a sperm coming from their ribs. Go ahead. I'm listening. Bear with, bear with me one second, I, and I'll okay. I'll tell you all about it. Bear with me one second. Let me get my reading glasses because I don't read. I don't see as well as I used to. All right. Bear with me one second. Maybe you need to pray to Jesus because he make the blind see. Muhammad, he cannot make the blind see. I feel sorry for you. Jesus said of his own self, he could do nothing. He came to do the will of the one. Yeah, who this is the man. This is, self, this is the man. This is the man. But the Quran says, I I make the blind see. Oh, I actually, heal the leper. Actually, the, I, I, actually, I, 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 I. So Jesus, the man, I he can do nothing of his own. We don't worship Jesus, the man. We worship Jesus, the Christ. He is the word of God and the word of God can heal you is not the man. We don't worship a man. You are the one who follow a man and worship a man and his name is Allah. No. No. I just repeat it was from was from the Bible not the Quran. Yes, yes, my friend. I you, you don't you, you don't quote a verse. You don't quote a verse from the Bible without forgetting and forgetting the other verses because the Bible says that Jesus said, "I am before Abraham. I am. I am." So don't don't don't, don't go there now. Let us finish this. About a God who believe women have a sperm coming from their breast. I want to know how this happened. How the bones of the women, the, the location of the necklace, generate sperm for the women. Let, show me the doctor. I'm fix, I'm finding it for you. Just bear with me one second. Taking long, my friend. <laughs> it's very interesting that that you uh, you like to try to talk over people on your program and. Well, you are changing topic. And, no, I, actually, we came in. And and I am rude, my friend. I am, I am rude. We are Arab. That, Arab are cause, rude. Arab are rude. I'm like your prophet. We are Arab. So now, so now, don't waste my time. Give me speeches. You are easy to figure out. You said something. It's very funny. I want you to get the proof. Who is the doctor who said to you that women she have a sperm coming from the bones of her ribs? I want to know his name. Right. I've got the book in my hand right now. Uh -huh. Give me a moment to look for right. it. I would. Okay. Developing the human, mm -hmm. uh, doc, Dr. Moore and Prasad. Dr. Moore, Dr. Moore, page, okay. Page, page, the, human the, development, page, page what? Page what? Page what? Page what? The fifth edition, page number eight. Uh, but this guy is a Muslim, right? No, this is just a medical doctor. No, he's a doctor. He, no, he's a Muslim. We know his name. His name is mentioned in all Islamic books because he's a Muslim. Now, what uh, he said, Dr. read Moore, for me, read Dr. for me. Moore, yes, Moore. yes, yes, he is. Yes, read for me what he said. Let us, let us laugh. Let, it, let you laugh. Mm -hmm. The Quran, the embryonic development. Uh -huh. In the Holy Quran, uh -huh. Allah speaks about the stages of embryonic development. Uh -huh. We created man, Uri Blame and Shaitan, the regime. We created man from an, an extractive clay. Then we made him as a drop in a place of settlement, firmly fixed. Mm -hmm. Then we made the drop into Alaka, which is a, leap, a leech or suspended mm -hmm. thing or blood clot. Okay. And we made. Into okay. okay, stop, 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 stop. We no, would, we, stop. We, no, 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 just wait, just wait, just wait, just wait, because you are giving me an answer about a wrong question. We will talk about that later. No, I'm talking well, about well, the well, sperm well, of the women, my friend. You are talking well, about after the women get a breath net. 
the question here is not about the women after getting pregnant. About the women, there's a gushing fluid come from the men and the women. The gushing fluid come from the women ribs. Right. Chapter right. 86, yeah. Abdul. Listen, you are reading for me from Al Mu'minin chapter. This is different chapter. This is different chapter, different verse, different story. It's not about this. Listen, you are you are running away from the question. You are running away from the question. Where is the answer for this verse? Where Dr. Moore he said that no, you need to show me. You need to show me. reading what I was reading. No, you are not reading. I know I saw it all. I have a book about it. I answer all those Abdul. I got them busted. I made I, I made them shish kebab. Go and buy my books from Amazon. It's called Quran and Science in Depth. Those guys are a joke. And nowhere he speak about the ribs thing. So now give me the answer. Where Dr. Moore he spoke about women she have breast Look, testicles. Do you want me to read the whole book to you? All I, I do is okay. No, show me. Show me. I show me where he well, spoke about women have <laughs> sperm from their ribs. Give me the page right. number. Give me the page number. Right. Hmm. So, so I suggest that you and your listeners get the the book. No, you show it to me. No, no, no. We want you to show it to us. Where he said I'm that not, women I'm, sperm. You don't dictate what I do and what I don't do. No, no. I, I, I tell you, no. You, I challenge you because you're a liar. Because you're a liar. Where it is? Show me where he said was, women they have a sperm coming from their ribs. You are a liar. Otherwise, read it for us. I, I'm listening. You the conversation I'm, and you interrupted. I'm listening. No, you are not reading I, that. Okay, go go for that. Go straight. Okay, read for me right away. Which where he say the ribs of the women? Do you see the word the ribs of the women there in that page? Absolutely. You already tried to get. Do you me to see? That question do you see? You do you see the word ribs in the whole page there? Do you see the word ribs of the women? Do you see it there? You can find the book. My friend, the human my friend, you are you are you are just a joke. Show me where he spoke about chapter eighty six, verse number seven. He did not speak about it. You are lying. Be honest. Not lying. Okay, then read for me where he spoke about no, it. You don't dictate what I do and what I don't do. You, because this is the question, the question about chapter 86, verse number 7. Dude, what you didn't expect me to do is quickly <laughs> give you a record. Abdul, give you a Abdul you aren't, you, aren't you reading this guy for me because you want to answer this question? Is, is, is that the purpose, right? So I'm no, asking you about chapter 86, verse number 7. In that page you are reading from, in that page you are reading from, he is not talking about the chapter 86 at all. You you didn't let me finish reading what I was okay, reading. Okay, show me where, show me. Okay, I'm, I'm listening. Go ahead, go ahead. Guys, listen, listen, listen carefully. No, listen. You. you didn't want to get there, do you? So now let's move to another topic. Because no, no, we, we will not move. I'm not, I'm not no, 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 you will not move. I want you to read because even what you just said is a joke. I'm going to get you. You and Dr. Moore busted. Continue. The book Developing the Human by Dr. Moore and Prasad. Okay, mm. so he is not a Muslim, by the way. You uh -huh. are a liar. Uh -huh. And I suggest <laughs> that you get the book Developing the Human, mm. and you can read all about No, why you don't read for us? No, you read for us. We want to love. It is comedy day. What? Read for it's us. Re read for us. The human development. Uh, show How the human is developed according to the Quran, according to Dr. Moore, is the one you choose. Go ahead. Go ahead. Tell us. Your manners are lacking, and that's why My you friend, do need Islam. Isn't, isn't it you who choose the topic? Isn't it you who choose the topic? Finish it. Read for me with Dr. Moore. Read for me, Dr. Moore. Read for me, Dr. Moore, so we can laugh, because this guy is a joke, and I will show you, and I will get you busted in front of everybody. Why do you want to run? You are the one who opened the topic. We want to finish it. Continue reading. Nervous. In, in being nervous and being intimidated, you have made a fool out of yourself. You are the one who is intimidated. That's why you, you change the topic. You are the one who opened the topic. Finish it. Here I am right here. It, Immediately. So, so answer. Be, so don't change the topic. So don't change the topic. Dr. Moore, read for us. Read for us. Dr. Moore, I want to laugh. I'm listening. Well, two sentences, you already interrupted me. Then you interrupted me again. <laughs> you are not even answering. Where and Dr. Moore, he spoke about the ribs of the women giving sperm. You are supposed to quote for me, Dr. Moore, so he will answer about the chapter 86, uh, verse number 7. What? So, I was uh, going to do until you interrupted me. So because of your rudeness and your lack of manners, you right. read it yourself. You're, you're, you're right. You yeah, then, okay, I will read, read it for you. I, I will read it for you. Do you want me to open Dr. Moore for you so we can run? So we can yeah, run? How about you do that? How about you do that? Okay, hold on. Hold on. Okay, please do. <clears throat> what you're not going to do is you're not going to dictate to me what I'm going to I will, do. What I will, I'm not I will show. Do. I will show in the in the screen what your guy he said so we can laugh. 
Yeah, let's do that, shall we? Yeah. It's very interesting that you, you quickly try to go to uh, what you did was you try to go to the most complicated topic, which is science. Okay? You want to go to the most complicated topic. And why do you do that? Because you're intimidated. Because you know that the foolishness coming out of your mouth All right. is, is. Let us see. Let us see the foolishness. Let us see the foolishness of the man. Let us see. This is, guys, this is, doc, this is Dr. Moore. I want you to look with me in the screen. And read yeah, with me what Dr. Moore he said, so we can laugh together. Yeah, and and by the way, he's not a Muslim. By the way, we will see. We will see. Okay, hold on, hold on. Because if he is the Muslim, that is mean he's a liar. Because how come he find that this is coming from God, but yet he don't want to believe in that God? That means he's a scam. You just admitted that he is a scam. Because if somebody believe that this is the truth and this is coming from the true God, that means he is a scam. Now let us read together what he said. This guy he never spoke about what you just read for us. This is a big fat lie. Let us read what he said. It the statement of the human embryos, read with me, read me, was not proposed until 1940 and etc. And then he continued. Let us see. The Quran, chapter 23, verse number 12 to 16, indicate that there is a lag of a grab between two early stages of a growth. How does that compare with the modern science and knowledge? Recurrently, uh, says Dr. Moore, read carefully what he said. It will establish that there is a lag of delay in the development of the embryo during the in, in implementation, whatever. The agreement between the lag of uh, or gap in development mentioned in the Quran and slow rate of a change uh, uh, occurring during the second and third weeks. Amazing! Two and second and third weeks. Read, read carefully. Then he says, Find Dr. Moore, conclude by saying the agreement that he has found the Quran statement may help to close the gap between the science and the religion which has existed before for uh, for so many years. How is that? Right. Above yeah. evidence. Hold on, hold on. So what are you doing is confirming the, the truth. Hold, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Keep reading, hold on. Because everything you're going to read actually the, 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 Quran. the funny, the article. It it doesn't speak against the okay. Quran. It confirms the Quran. Okay, let because me show you. Let, let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. He could not read nor write. My friend. My friend. My friend. My friend. Let us read. Let us read. the invention of the modern Abdul, science. Abdul. Of, Abdul. Of the Abdul. 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 So you just shook down. You just broke down. You are. You, 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 you are. You are. You are. Are you going to hang up? You are you going? Are you going to hang up? Are you going to hang up and run? Is that what you do? Are you preparing yourself to hang you up? So you don't hang up. Okay, promise me. Promise me. Promise me. I'm not like these other people. Listen, listen. Don't use the word shit. Don't use the word shit. Otherwise, I will shit on your prophet. Listen. Listen. Be a brave man and promise me. You will not hang up until we finish the topic. Promise me. I'm not going to hang up. Okay. I'm right here. Because I am right here in your mouth. All right. And giving you everything that you need to have. And everybody will be laughing at you now. Read carefully with me. And read, lies. Okay, read carefully with me. This is what Dr. Moore he said. Let us laugh together. What you're doing is confirming the Quran. Go ahead, read. No problem. Right, okay, so let us read together. Start. Let us let us read together. This is Dr. Moore. Dr. Dr. Keith Law Moore. This is the name, you right? In the front of you. Let us see what he said. Okay. Let us see the topic. <clears throat> Yeah. Actually, oh, yeah. they, they, are not, they, they are not even quoting the where is the Quran the whole article in front of me But there's nothing. Where is the Quran? There's no Quran I mean, keep reading. It's a it's a volume. It's a book So that you hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I, I need to find character? I need to you find want, okay the, Do you have a link? Do you have a link? Do you have a link? Stage of development. Do you have a link? Do you have a link for it? Do you have a link for for it? Do you have a link for it? Do you I have, have a book in my hand. I don't need a, a, a link. Okay, the what book the, okay then read for us the read book. It. Read for us the book because the link in the front of me, here we go, there's nothing. I look for his name. It says look, that uh, he found, he found, but doesn't say. He don't even quote the Quran. He's so the whole, concerned about this. The whole He's article, so Abdul, let me show you what Dr. Moore he said in the Quran. He spoke about the alaqa. You Muslims are a bunch of crazy. You do not know even what he's talking about. Dr. Yes, Moore, Dr. Dr. Moore, here can you read for me the verse he read for you? Dr. Moore, read the translation for me. I'm not reading anything for you. Why? Why you will not read? Because because you will be exposed for the false yeah. translation. This is the word alaqa. This is what your Dr. Moore he did read. 
let me let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you, and and, and we will laugh together. This is this is this is what Doctor Moore he read for you, in chapter two verse twenty two verse number five, and specifically chapter twenty three verse number four, fourteen. Sorry, let us read together. According to yes. Doctor Moore, it is he said he, he said he said that the Quran saying there is a word it's called leech. Is that correct? Right. Alaka. Okay. All right. right. Okay. Where we can find in any Islamic translation the word leech? Show me. It's not the word leech. It's 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 a it's similar to the leech. No, it's, is it? So what it is? So what it is? So what it is? So what it is? What it is? It's a it means a suspended thing that which clings. No, it doesn't mean the no. All mean all Muslims literal. all Muslims it, all, all see that's see this is what all Muslims. Let us see what Muslim translation is. Muslim translation yeah. is listen. Muslim translation says that this is a dead blood. Do you agree? It's it's a clot. A, a it's clinging a, it's thing. It's a congealed. It's no, it's a congealed yeah. dead, dead blood. Yes or no? Uh, absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. So how the sperm became a congealed dead blood? You have to read the book. It says it clearly that it's impossible, my friend. What read the book? He says it is alaka. He said it looked like a leech. The Quran doesn't say it looked like a leech. He did not say it's a dead blood there. The like Quran leech. said. The Quran <laughs> said. The Quran said it's a dead blood. Now let me ask you, who understand the Quran better, Doctor Moore or Muhammad? Let me let me tell you something. I have a book, the book mm. in my hand right now, mm. and it shows an actual picture of a leech, and right above that it shows the human embryo. But the, and the human embryo in this picture mm. is is absolutely in the similar shape as the leech. In the Quran, it is not talking about the word leech or the thing. So what the is the Quran talking about? What the Quran talking about? What is the word there is used? It, it says alaka, a clinging substance. That would clean clean. substance. Okay, let us, let us see. Okay, okay. Let us see. Let us see what your prophet he said. Do you do you, right. do you think do you think your prophet do you do you, do you think your prophet he, he know better or you? You've asked me a question again and you've interrupted me again. Do you think the, do you think the prophet do you think the prophet knows better than you? Or? because you know you're live and I'm shaking you up. Then you want everybody to will see in a second what your prophet said. Are you afraid to see what your prophet said? It says. Are you, are you afraid? Are you afraid to see what your prophet said about this? Absolutely not. Okay. What? So I'm asking you, friendly, if we go and ask your prophet what he meant by this, isn't it better than we listen to you and to me? I think your well, prophet he deserves more respect, right? And let me if, say, and, say something. The prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, he didn't mean anything by it. What? Who? The one who meant something by it was Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Okay, no so problem, no problem. Muhammad but your prophet, when he it, said he didn't mean anything about it, okay. he didn't mean anything by it. He was revealing what was what was revealed to him through the angel Gabriel. May Allah be pleased with him. All right. So, the, but but Muhammad your prophet, okay, listen, 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 listen. Equate this book. No problem. To equate the Quran with the prophet Muhammad as having revealed the Quran himself. That is not the truth. But you, but your creator, prophet, my, God, your creator, my friend, you my talk God, too much. God. You talk too much. You don't. You are not saying anything. I'm asking you. I'm asking you, do your prophet understand the Quran properly? This is the whole, there's no need or for this speech you are giving me. Do oh, your sure, prophet, yeah. okay. So your prophet, he understand the Quran properly. So if we go right now and we see what your prophet said, are you going to say your prophet is a liar? Why would I say that? I'm asking you, are you going to say that? No, why would I say that? I'm okay. asking you, why would so I say let that? Us see, let us see what your prophet said then, and that will solve the problem. What do you think? Good? What did he say? What? And what no, no. What I'm asking you. If what, you, if I saying? show you, are you going to say? Because I'm, I'm, I'm predicting that you will say I don't believe in it. I can't tell you what I'm going to say before you said what you. you okay, let us see what your prophet said. Read with me carefully. Read, read with me. Read with me. Read with me. Okay, okay. Read with me. Are you, are you looking at the screen? Are you looking at the screen? Stop screaming, you idiot! Look, read with me. Your prophet is said something. Respect your prophet and read. Read, your prophet said that the sperm stay in the belly of the women for 40 days. Do you agree with that? I absolutely, based on this book that I'm holding my hand by Dr. Moore. Yeah, absolutely. 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 And Dr. Moore, he said that the sperm stay in the women for 40 days. You confirm that? Yes, absolutely. You liar, big fat liar. Show me where it says that. I'm, I'm a big fat liar? Yes, show me. Which page it says oh, oh, that the oh, sperm oh, stay oh, in the women for 40 days as a sperm? I want to see that. 
let me answer your question. I'm listening no, Show me where, show me where Dr. Moore, your scam, said that the women's sperm, there's a woman, she have a sperm, or the man have a sperm, and the, and the sperm of the man stay in the belly of the women for 40 days. I want to see that. Oh, look, brother, let me, let me. Look, Don't call me, brother. I'm not your brother. I'm not the brother of the devil. You are a follower of the devil. Now answer. Where in the book it says that you are a liar, you are a scam. Otherwise, show me. I challenge you not to hang up, not to run, and to show me the page and to read for me. Dr. Moore, in page, etc., I read for us. He said that the semen of the man stay in the womb for 40 days. I'm listening. Right. Absolutely. Show me. Okay. I'm listening. If you what do you want me to do? You want me to give you a, a whole show, uh, show me, uh, show me. You said, you said book? absolutely. He said that. You said absolutely, Doctor Moore. He said that. Show book. me. I've got a book in my hand. Show me. Read, read for us. If you want to know this, just you buy the book. My and friend, don't tell me read the book. My friend, my friend, my friend. Don't waste my time. Don't waste my time. People have? are listening. You see, I don't want you to convince me that I'm wrong. Convince everybody. That Christian I'm prince is wrong. Okay, no I'm problem. So now anything. either you are got busted, you have no answer, or you read for us. Where Dr. Moore he said that science approved that Look. semen, semen of a man stay in the womb of the mother for 40 days. Right. It's absolutely in the book. Where? And if you buy the you buy the book. No, read for us. Don't tell me if you buy the book. Okay. You have the book in your hand, my friend. You have the book in your friend. Just read it. Read, read for us. Show us where it says that. Yeah. If you find the book, show us where it says that. that you are a liar, aren't you? No, I am. Then okay, show us. Brother. Tell us in page. You are recording. I will make you famous in YouTube. You are already famous. People are recording you. Tell us which page. Tell us. Tell us. I'm not going to flip. You this are a liar. You are a liar, and you admit otherwise. Show us which I'm page. Not. Which page in Doctor Moore he said that women. They have received the sperm of the man and it stayed there inside them in the you womb for 40 days. You have the access to the internet right there at your fingertips. I don't you I don't see I cannot find anything in that book. I cannot find it. I, you, you said you have it. You said you have it. I don't have it. You said you don't book in my hand. show me a hard copy of the book. You in are my a, hand. Then read you, it. You, are you, then read it. Gonna be like, Abdul, what's wrong with you book? guys? Do you, you see guys? Do you see why I say every every Abdul is a liar? He had the book in the front of him. He said he confirmed absolutely. I believe in that. Absolutely, the prophet saying the truth that the sperm and stay in the womb of the women for forty days, and he said it's in this book. Okay, show us which page. Read for us. I'm not going to flip through this book and find. Show it. us. Once you I'm have to flip I'm, because you're I'm, a liar. I'm, so how you know it is there if you do not know how to find it? You liar. I've already read is this it, book. Is it, is, it is it there? Is it there? Is it there? Is it there? You give is you a it, class. It if you want, so you have no answer. You are here supposed to get me busted. Why you don't want to get me busted? According to science, you and idiot. I'm listen, not, listen, not. listen. I, I will put you in mute for a minute because you scream, you say nothing. According to science, semen cannot live more than seven days, maximum. You, the prophet, is a big fat liar when he said semen stay alive for 40 days. What do you say about that? Say something. What do you say what? about that? Do semen what? live more than seven days? Answer your question if you if you hold your comments for a moment. Mm. I'll answer your question. Okay, what's the answer? The semen cannot live more. Okay, than I'm going. To, I'm going to make some tea. I'm listening. Give me the answer. Okay, please listen. Just okay. just stop and be quiet for I, thirty seconds. I'm listening. Go ahead. If you thirty go seconds, go ahead. Dude. Tell me the answer. Don't give me a speech. Give me the answer. Right. right. You just said that semen can't live for, for more than seven days. Mm -hmm. But, brother, each and every person on this earth, uh -huh. uh, I, I'll be 47 years old mm -hmm. in just a few weeks. Mm -hmm. And guess what? I used to be sperm myself. You used to be sperm. Don't tell me that sperm can't live in the womb of a woman more than seven days. <laughs> it develops and it grows. and it, it, it grows. The sperm it grows? The sperm grow? The sperm grow? The sperm the sperm. It's a uh, the sperm, he, my friend, the sperm will grow. The sperm will grow. It's sperm is boy or girl, depending on the genes. What do you mean, sperm will grow? Just, if your prophet saying the sperm stay as a sperm for forty days, the sperm right. grow and, and live forty and it days. Develops to another another. Uh, it begins to develop. No, it says it stays as a sperm for forty days, and then after that, it became for right. a similar period it, a piece of developed. a fish. And then it, you were you were once an embryo. You were once that sperm, and now you're a friend. Your prophet words. Just, your prophet 
word is so clear. Your prophet words is so clear. He said the sperm stay gathered, gathered. Listen carefully. Let me read for you what your prophet said. This is your Muslim translation. And this is just a search from Google. It says the sperm inside the women can live up to five days. Do you see it? Do you see it? Your prophet said the sperm of the women gathered, gathered in the womb of the women for 40 days how such one a thing, thing is, can happen one thing is for certain is that the quran has revealed these things for over 1400 years ago which is a stupid and each one each and every one of the which is a stupid miracles which is a stupid been confirmed confirmed uh, by who confirmed confirm, that's a, that's a lie i i just it's i just got you busted i just got you busted don't tell me it's confirmed it's i got you busted right now confirmed by who I just no, get you busted. I confirm to you by science that this is a lie. This is science. This is a website of science. It says sperm live for five days. Your prophet said sperm gathered inside the women for 40 days. Answer. Right. Before it transfers into another stage of development. It is then Probably still, you, still it is there for 40 really days. Common. Listen, listen. First of all, uh, uh, sperm does not transform to anything. Only stupid believe in that. My friend, sperm. my friend, you, you, sperm, you, sperm you, you, does not transform. Let the, the, me say, uh, listen, me listen. What is the egg of the women? What is the egg of the women? What is the egg of the women? Your prophet, your prophet, he mentioned the sperm. The sperm will turn into... A flesh and he will be the, the sperm will be right. 40 days as a sperm. What is the egg? Right. So if you want me to answer you, what is the woman? What is the woman? Egg? You have to give him time to do it. I'm it's asking you. Me. I give you time. I know to you're answer. nervous. Oh. <laughs> That's a good one. Who is the nervous here? Abdul, listen, listen. I am so nervous. Seriously. I, I am. I am really, really, really so nervous. Now answer. Respond, okay, can you show me? Asking. Can you show me one one Islamic book, including Doctor Moore, saying that a sperm stay inside the women for forty days? Can you show me that, please? I'm very nervous. She's one your voice. She's your, the one that found your, this your voice is it's, cutting. He's the one that developed this book. No, the it, whole it, issue. it's not about develop here. It says it says read, read carefully, read carefully, Abdul. Mm -hmm. Do you know how to read English? Do you know how to read? You see. You do not know how to read Arabic. I understand, but do you, do you know how to read English? It says, "is gathered in the form of semen." So, what is the form? Semen in the womb of your mother for forty days. Do you see it? What I'm you is that Doctor Moore is the first doctor. The Can first you read for me what? Do, do, stop saying Doctor Moore. Things. Stop saying Doctor Moore unless you read for me what Doctor Moore said about how many days. Sperm stay inside the women, sperm. otherwise, shut up. Oh, after the development, after the development, there's no development yet. This is the first stage. This is the first stage. Sperm stay as a sperm for 40 days. This is the first stage. Said after the development, what development? Abdul, 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 potato, potato, liar, coward. Uh, don't hang up on me. I'm nervous now. I'm shaking. Answer. Right. It says it says it's gathered in the form of semen in the womb of your mother for 40 days. Can you show me one scientist in the world believe in such a garbage? Yes. Who? Dr. Moore, I've already show me. Then thing. show me. Stop saying Dr. But Moore. Read for us. Read for us, understand. liar. You are a liar. You are a liar. Show me you where Dr. Moore. Understand. Show I'm me. Not, show I'm, me. Okay, let me just read I'm, for me. I, I, I'm not, where? Which page? Dr. Moore said the I'm sperm not, stay inside the women for forty days. Show me. Look, look you, you know what? Sperm stayed inside the woman and began to develop from day one. From this is not what the verse saying. This when, is not. First of all, Abdul. First of all, Abdul. Abdul. Stupid. Stupid. No, I don't understand what you are saying because the sperm does not start develop. You idiot. It is the egg. It is the egg. It is the egg. You donkey. You donkey. 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 Listen. It is the egg who start development. It's not the sperm. The sperm. The sperm does not develop. The sperm. The sperm activate the egg and deliver the DNA and die. Demolish. There's nothing next. Nothing next. Nothing next. The, the one who devolves is, is, is the egg. Your prophet, forget about the egg. So and now, Abdul, son of Muta, listen, I don't have time for kids. Either 
you agree that you are a coward and dr. Moore never said anything even though he is a liar like you or you read for us is that fair guys so I'm going to give you the mic be a man open the Quran tell us which page read for us that dr. Moore said that the sperm of the women stay inside her gathered inside the women inside the women for 40 days show me or I will help you more show me where dr. Moore he said that the sperm development net because you like to use this word take 40 days show me the mic is yours I'm listening I'm able to get this information. listen show me okay I'm listening if you get the book the develop don't tell me if you get the book are you a donkey or what are you a donkey don't stop telling me if you get the book show me I do not have the book and you are a liar open the book your book in your front of your hand you were flipping the pages a second ago read for us which page it says that the sperm stay inside the women and took it 40 days to develop as you said I will go with you you said develop even the hadith doesn't say that I will go with you show me where it says that I'm listening so show you where it says what the, the sperm took it 40 days to develop show me where it says that in dr. Moore book brother you're gonna have to understand the don't call me brother and the, I don't understand no don't waste my time in order for you to let me mute you let me mute you you are just a kid admit it you are in the corner and you get busted if you don't show us people are do you see that do you see the chat the chat is boiling people are laughing to dying from laughing so you better show us where you better show us where can you show us where it says that or you cannot be honest Yes, I can. Okay, in the, show us. the book, the developed book okay, by Doctor Moore. Show us, show us. I'm, 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 I'm listening. Show us which page and read for us. I'm, 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 going, I'm going to I, shut I'm up. Not gonna, I'm not looking it up for you. I'm not giving you the page. I'm giving you the book. You have to study really? the whole book and read really? the book. Really? Okay, understand guys, I'm not going to give you the for page. Me, I will give you the book because there is no such a thing. You're a liar. You are a liar. You are a liar. I just admit you are a liar, like a prophet. Listen, listen. You're a prophet. You're a prophet. He is. His specialty is lying. Is a stupid don't be stupid like him because he said many stupid things as an example I just showed you what he said that women she have a sperm coming from her ribs did that dr. Moore element. does dr. Moore say that women have a sperm have you ever you heard of any donkey element. in the world agree that women have a sperm since when women have a sperm you're you're acting like an elementary since, school since child. when women have a sperm answer since when women have a sperm women don't have sperm they have a so egg. why you so why your Quran says though Brother, you need you, you, you don't call you, me brother and answer yeah, the Quran. This is the Quran in front of your eyes, it's chapter limited. 86, yeah. verse number seven. It is gushing fluid coming from the man and the women, and that will cause the baby. Do you agree? Right, there's no fluid within the woman, of course, there's fluid, in and the that woman. will make you the baby, and that will make the, the baby, and that yes, will make fluid the, okay, the and that fluid, you, and that the fluid, that, according that, to the Quran. Thank you very much, you, guys. You Guys, you haven't hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. This guy he just admitted that it's a fluid coming from the women will make the baby. Now, the Quran says in that chapter that that fluid is coming from the ribs of the women. Do you really believe in that? PhD, listen, not an authority on this. Abdul, subject. do you if believe? You, you believe? Show me on one on person he have a PhD. Abdul, show me where you more. Here we go, Dr. Yeah. Moore again. But donkey, listen, I have many mules around me. And you are just a small donkey mules they don't dare even to get a close show me where dr. Moore he said that women have have a sexual fluid it's coming from their bones and the bones of their ribs specifically the mic is yours can you read for us I, I didn't hear anything you said because I was can you can you read for us can you read for us can you read for us anywhere in dr. Moore book it says that women have a sexual fluid coming from the ribs of the women look can you let me, show us? Let me ask you a question. Don't ask Do you me. Not ask, like, answer the question. The woman? Can you find me anyone in the world believe no. that women she have a sperm coming from her ribs? Yes or no? If that's what the book says, which it does, yes, I believe that. Absolutely. But what you said to me you want to prove it to me from Dr. Moore book. This is the whole point. Where if Dr. Moore he said uh, that women have a sperm well, coming from I'm their not, ribs? I'm not going to. You, you realize that it would take me time to look through this book and find that stuff. Okay, I will give you, uh, so I will give I, you, listen, not, I will give you 10 years. Is that, that is that a good I'm deal? I will give you 10 years. Is that a good deal? 
I don't need 10 years. What I, what I need you to do is no, take some you, money no, I will give you 20 you know, years. You are a liar. Otherwise, why you don't need 10 years? You need it because you are you, maybe by then you will die and then you escape from this challenge. Otherwise, show it to me right now. You are the one who read the whole they, book. You are the one who read the whole book. They, Did you read the whole book or only the cover? Did you read the whole book? I read the whole book. The okay. name of the book so is we, The Developing Human the, by Dr. Great, great. Dr. So where, where Dr. Moore, he can explain to us how the Quran say women have a sperm coming from their ribs. According to science, women have you no want sperm. Me to tell you, where? You, you want me to tell you where? Uh -huh. Okay, I will tell you where. It's in the book, The Developing Human by Dr. Moore. <laughs> right. You know, you know, they, they say in China, he left as a donkey, he never came back as a horse. Do you want me to tell you where? Do you want me to tell you where? Do you want me to tell right. you where? It's in the book. The, the one, the, 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 do you want me to tell you where? Do you want me to, right. Are you okay? You, how old are you? How old are you? How, how, are you? how old are you? How old are you? How, how, you realize you how old are you? Abdul, for, 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 for the sake of Allah, uh, leg. You know, uh, uh, let, let, all let, your let, listeners. How, how, how old are you for the sake of Allah, leg? So, Abdul, Abdul, huh? uh, just to be honest, I want you. To, I want. I want to be sure what that you are not. Me, Abdul. Listen, my name is Mujahid Al Islam. You are Wait. Abdul. You are Abdul. You are a potato, and you are not a Mujahid. You are a potato. If you are a Mujahid, you will go into jihad. I, I'm you a Mujahid. A I'm right here doing what I do. Right where, now. where, 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 doing what? You cannot even read the page for us. You, you don't even dare to read the page for us. Having in the calls you of are right Abdul. You are Abdul, and your prophet is our joke. We are making fun of him. He is a donkey. He is a liar, and you don't dare to answer. If you are a mujahid, then give me the answer. This is the interpretation of a Jalalain in front of your eyes. It says that there is a sperm of the women coming from the backbone of the man and the ribs of the women. Answer. How kind of a stupid prophet he says such a thing? The mic is yours. You, okay, you want me to give you the page? It's one of the pages within the book, The Developing Human by Dr. Moore. <laughs> it's going to be one of those pages. My I'm friend, not gonna... Okay, let me, let me tell you something. Do you want me to give you a page? I have a book, all of it, exposing Dr. Moore and making him look like a joke because you he's a look joke. It up. I did, I did. It, there's nowhere in the book, his book, it says that women have a sperm coming from their ribs, and you are a liar. Otherwise, do you have his okay, book? Okay, listen, listen. What about what about? You don't even have the book. You was trying to look up information on on the internet. You, I, cannot find it. I could not, I could not, I could not but find it. Listen, listen. <laughs> I could not find it, Abdul. You are a liar. Show it to me. Why well, you don't you show it to me? You haven't read the book, but you're you're calling me a liar. No, and I have I, read the book. No, listen, let me tell you what I read. Let me tell you what I read. I read the website. It's called Quran Miracles, and I refute them. I they are the, I would they, shake they are the one who is quoting Dr. Moore, and I, they are donkey like you. Now you cannot answer why the Quran says women have a sperm coming from her ribs. Now you're calling names like a child. I'm not calling you names. You, your prophet he said I, you are a donkey. Let me, let me show you that your prophet said now, every Muslim is a donkey. Let me show you. Hold on, hold on. I'm not calling you names. You're a prophet. Yep. You're a prophet. Say it. You're a prophet. Say it. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let, let me show you. Hold on, hold on. You said I'm calling names, right? What if I show you right. a prophet saying you that you are a donkey? Don you called me a liar. I haven't called you any names at all. You are a liar you because you here we go. Read, read, read with me carefully. Read with me, please. You're a prophet. He said, "Isn't it he who raises his head?" Hold on. Don't talk. I will mute you. Is it he who raised his head before the Imam afraid that Allah may transform him his head into the head of a donkey or his figure is a figure of a donkey don't tell me mr. Mujahid you never raised your head before the Imam because this is impossible do you really believe that if somebody raised his head before the Imam finished the prayer Allah will make him uh, his head the head of a donkey yes or no the mic is yours that, that's a fool thing to say do you say uh, do you, are, you, are you are yeah. you saying your prophet for, is foolish no that's not what i'm saying I, it's I, I, just, thing I, I just said to you the hadith the hadith says that i'm reading the hadith it's not my words the prophet said not me is it he who raises his head before the imam afraid that allah may transform his head into a head of a donkey do you agree with that or a face of a donkey do you agree uh, 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 so you are you under the impression that we should take that literally so what does that mean your prophet what 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 it's mean Allah will make you in a figure of a donkey if it's not literally explain to us you, you think that he truly meant so that. what he meant what he meant by saying donkey what he meant why he did not say what? a rabbit what he meant by if, a donkey what does that mean you're gonna have to have a use a little okay. bit of common sense okay logic. use the you use your common sense let us say you are a president and you are saying to your followers you are saying to your audience if somebody raises his head before i finish my talk 
Allah may transform his head into a figure. Do you see the word figure? A face of a donkey. What is the metaphorical of that? Do you think that we're supposed to take that literally? Don't tell me, do you think? I don't think anything. I'm asking you. You answer. What does that mean? What does that mean? I'm answering. You are, I'm answering. Are you going to give me 30 seconds okay. to answer? Then give me the Just answer. Me. Don't tell me don't think. You keep, because you keep repeating. Well, you keep repeating. a question. When you present it. Listen, I have to mute you. You talk too much like, like, a, like a woman in the delivery room. Don't tell me you think. Do you think? Do you think he meant this? Do you think? Tell me what it's meant. Okay? I will give you the mic. Tell me what it's meant. Don't tell me. Don't repeat. Don't tell me I'm going I'm going to find you the answer in Dr. Moore book. Huh? Now answer what Muhammad he meant by saying, May Allah transform you, your head, into a figure of a donkey. The mic is yours. Okay. All right. Give me you're gonna give me 30 seconds to answer. I will, give you, I will give you me? five minutes. Go ahead. I'm listening. Okay. So think about this logically mm. and with just a little bit of common sense. Mm -hmm. The Muhammad, peace and blessed be upon him, mm -hmm. wasn't suggesting that this is going to literally happen mm -hmm. that this is that a lot knowing that we are faulty as humans that we make mistakes as humans okay. that we're uh, uh creatures of compulsion sometimes where we mm -hmm. do things and, and we don't realize that we're doing them or mm -hmm. uh you know because we make mistakes or whatever the case might be mm -hmm. so the prophet muhammad peace and blessed be upon him was just trying to stress mm -hmm. that you should not mm -hmm. uh anticipate the movements of the imam Okay, so and that what, means that we're to follow the imam, let the imam lead, and I actually am an imam in my area, uh -huh. and to let the imam lead the prayer, mm -hmm. and you follow, and let him make the movement, and then you make the movement. Okay, it doesn't mean that a lot that knows us. So what? Knows the, us. What the point of saying? Aren't you afraid no, that Allah will make you a donkey? What does that mean then? He can say to you, "Don't raise your head." Is it a sin to raise your head before the, before the imam to the point Allah okay. will make you a donkey? Okay, well, think about this. In this conversation, you you've called me a donkey uh, numerous times, and by doing so, okay. you're acting. Okay, let me ask you. Let, let me ask. Let me ask. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. If I show you a think verse, about, if I show you a verse from the Quran calling you a donkey, what you would do? Uh, once again, you interrupted. You claim so that you are. Everybody you heard you. Everybody heard you. Everybody heard you saying that you are an imam. Is that correct? Everybody heard absolutely. you saying. Okay. Absolutely. Do you know? Do you, do, you, do you speak Arabic? Do you speak Arabic? Thirty seconds. Do you speak okay. Arabic? Do you speak Arabic? I, I don't speak Arabic fluently to be an imam. So how you know can, what the imam means? Yes, I know. That means you can. You will teach the people Islam and you will teach them Quran. How you can teach them Quran? You don't speak Arabic. I don't have to speak Arabic fluently. So I what? Speak what do you do? The of the Quran. What I, do you I do? I recite in the Arabic language the verses of the Quran. Okay, uh -huh. so I don't have to be able to hold a conversation in Arabic. That's not a prerequisite. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. In the Quran, it says, in the Quran, in the Quran, in the Quran, Mr. Imam, as long as you are Imam, I want to learn from you. In the Quran, it says, the, the similarity of those who carry the Torah is the same as a donkey who carry it, carry books in the top of his head. Do you agree with that? What do you mean? The similarity of those who carry books the same as a donkey. Are you a person who carry a donkey, a carry a book, or you are a donkey? Which means, what did you read that at? which mean, which mean, a person who carry a book but he cannot read it, he's a donkey. This is what your prophet saying. Do you agree with this? A person that what? The one who carry he a broke. book, the one who carry a book but he cannot read it, he's a donkey. Right, meaning the one who carries the book and does not read it is a donkey. Or he cannot read it. No, no, that or he does not. He chooses not to. Oh. You understand what I'm telling you? Okay, and did you choose but to you read have, the? You have, you okay. have the book. Okay, 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 okay. okay. You, you refuse to follow. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So you carry the Quran. Do you choose to read it or not to read it? I read it. How you can read it, but you don't know Arabic? I do. This is a, this is a few verse you know. Okay, read for me this verse in the front of you. Read this verse for me. Don't tell me Iqra. This is the only one you know. Bismillah al-Rahman al-Rahim. I know a bunch of them. What are you talking okay, about? Read for me this one then. Read for me this one. It's in front of you on the screen. It's in the front of you on the screen. Read it for me. Read it for me. As long as you know how to read. Read it for me. It's in front of you on the screen. Do you want me to help you? Do you want me to help you? You, you claim. I'm, I'm, not looking. I'm on my cell phone. You can. I'm not even okay. looking at the screen. Okay. You are an I'm imam. I'm on my cell phone. Okay. okay. You are an I'm imam. At. You are an I'm imam. No problem. Which verse in the Quran speak about Torah, carrying Torah, and you will be like a donkey if you carry it without reading it or knowing how to read it? Which verse? Which which chapter? Which chapter? 
Got it right there. Which tell chapter? Me. Where? Where? What do you mean right there? Tell me which chapter. You are an imam, right? Yes. You're an imam in the mosque. Don't tell me you're an imam, but you do not know where this and verse is located. Where, where? Where? Where we can find this chapter? Brother, look, you're brother, looking at it right there. Brother, brother you are looking. Are you not? Abdul, you told me you are not looking at the screen, and now you are, are saying are to you? me you are looking at the screen. You told me you couldn't see the have... screen. So read look, it for I me. Okay, what chapter every... is that? What chapter is that? What? Okay, Abdul, Abdul, as long as you are looking at me at the screen, this is what a chapter. This is what chapter. This is what chapter. What chapter I'm reading from? I don't have, I don't have every verse and every reference memorized. You understand that? Okay. Nor is that a requirement. Okay. If, it, if I did have it, it'd be better. That'd be great. But no, I don't have that. I don't, I don't know. I can't tell you exactly where that's at. All right. And I don't feel ashamed. Okay. And I don't feel ashamed about that. There's okay. no, no reason to be ashamed okay. about that. So now, I'm sure I can. I, oh, I can oh, okay. No, okay. No problem. 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 You're a prophet, he Absolutely. said. No, your prophet, he said, we never send a messenger to any nation unless he speak the language of his people. Do you agree with that? I do. Okay. How your how Muhammad became if your prophet if he is not from your nation and don't speak your tongue? What do you mean? He, he's the, for, for one, I'm a peace and blessing. Be upon him. <laughs> my friend, my friend, I just ask you, I ask you, I ask you, I ask you, listen, listen. What do you mean? What, you told me what do you mean? You said to me, you said to me, what do you mean? Three seconds to answer that. To answer what? To answer what? Do you understand the question? Do you understand? Okay, do you understand the question first? Do you understand? You told me what do you mean? Why you said to me what do you mean? If you understand the question, it's, I can't. I can't believe you, you you don't understand it. That's why I'm asking. Uh, uh, okay, I'm not asking okay. You so what is the meaning? What, so I don't understand what is the question. meaning? What is I'm the what is I the meaning? Understand how you don't comprehend it. No problem. What is the meaning? What is the meaning? Tell us, tell us what is the meaning. What Very is the meaning? simple. Mm. Full thirty seconds. Uh, what That's is, all I need. No problem. Go ahead. A full thirty. Mm. <laughs> okay. So the Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, mm. came during the what's called the period of Jahiliyyah. The age of ignorance. Well, right. guess what? This period of Jahiliya happened amongst peoples of all of the prophets, the 124,000 that have come to this earth, uh, which is the Hadith. How do you know? Okay, how, do you so know? how do you know there are 123,000? Where do you get this number from? Once again, you didn't give me you didn't give me a 30, full 30 seconds. But you are giving me a number. They are scary. 124,000 prophets. What you you can ask me that after my, okay, okay, my no first problem. answer. Just take a note, guys. 124,000 prophets. Okay, go ahead. 24,000 go ahead and write it down and we'll, we'll, we'll get to that here in a second mm -hmm. But I'm gonna start over with this 30 seconds mm -hmm. and try to show a little self-respect and Respect mm -hmm. for your listeners. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this period of ignorance. It's it's times of darkness uh, in The lives of humanity mm -hmm. at different periods of time So the, so Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala our God our creator has sent prophets to address these people during these ages of darkness and mm -hmm. ignorance mm -hmm. where their man is living and doing what he wants to do and wh how he wants to do it, and he's worshiping. What does stones speech have to do with my question? I've I don't know. What does it have to do with my question? Don't Where's the answer? Me. I'm speaking 15 seconds. Okay, so we believe that <clears throat> Allah has sent prophets, peace and blessed be upon all of them, to address people of their various times. So Moses had mm -hmm. his own people, that the children of Israel that he was guiding, mm -hmm. the prophet Abraham. So blessed be upon Noah. Mm -hmm. All of these prophets dressed peoples of different times mm -hmm. that were going through different issues mm -hmm. in darkness. Okay. They were in dark. What does this have and to do with my question? So the Prophet Muhammad came, mm -hmm. and what did he do during the? He came to the Arabic people mm -hmm. that were lost in the darkness. They were doing very, very bad things during this age of Jahiliyyah. Mm -hmm. like okay, what? so like what? Like what? Kissing, kissing stones? Like what uh, they were doing? What they were doing? Kissing stones? They were working. They were worshiping stones and statues. Kissing stones. They were you're, using you're a prophet, sex slaves. You're, you're a prophet. And slavery. Stones. You're a prophet. You're interrupting me. You're, you're, a interrupting. you're a prophet. He promotes slavery. You're a prophet. He kisses stone and he lick it. So what is this? It's the same. It's, it's, did your prophet kiss his stones? Um, actually, did your second, did your prophet did your prophet kiss his stones? 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 You want me to answer your original question? Yes, yes. You, you want me to finish because, your because, original question? Yeah, because, because you mentioned something. I want I want to the, to clarify That's it for me, please. Answering your original question, and uh -huh. then you can ask questions. Because you are not that. answering my original no, question. You are just speaking, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Where is the answer? Uh, the question is very simple. You are not answering. Why? Yeah. Allah, he said, I just, never send, never, ever, ever, ever send a messenger unless he speak the tongue of his people. 
Right. Okay. Absolutely. Was I'm, Muhammad I'm, you, was Muhammad a prophet? Was 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 Muhammad a prophet? Was, answer your question. Was Muhammad a prophet for the Arab only, or his international I, prophet? No, no, I'm going to answer your question. Hmm. If you have a little bit of self-discipline, a little bit of self-respect, can you answer? do that as a man? No, I cannot. Can you do? That? Because I don't have self. I, I don't have self discipline. Discipline for a Satan. You are playing satanic game. You are not answering. Where's the answer? Muhammad is a, an Arab a prophet. He speak the tongue of the Arab. This is what the verse saying. Only prophet. He will be sent to his people. Do you see the word his people? Right. Okay. Um, so he is not sent. He is not sent to the black people. He is not sent to the Asian people. He is not sent yes, to the he white. He's sent to the Arab. Yes. Now, how yes, Muhammad he, became international? You know, how can you, how can you say that I'm I'm a, I'm a white Muslim revert? From Houston, Texas. Okay, that's me. You are stupid. That's me. You are stupid. That's all. That's me. You are stupid. That's all. Because you're because Muhammad Muhammad is a prophet for the Arab, and the Quran confirmed that. He's a, he he was actually the Quran states that he was Where? sent as a mercy to all of humankind. What, what, what all of my, my friend my friend do you see my do you do you see do you see the verse? The okay, question. read the verse for let me. me read, the, read, the, read, the, read the verse. Let me read answer the, the question. Let me answer the question, and we'll move on. Okay, so. Unlike the previous prophets that were sent to only their groups of people. So Isa alayhi salam, Jesus, peace and blessed be upon him, was only sent to the lost tribe of Israel. And he declared that in the Bible itself. He said, I was not sent but to the lost tribe of Israel. Question, okay? question. Because he was only sent okay, to Okay, question. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, what is the name of the book okay. of Jesus? What the, what the name of the book of Jesus? In the Quran. What the, what the, what the book of Jesus is called? What, the what is the word in is, is a Hebrew or a Greek? Uh, it's probably Aramaic. Who told you that? I don't have to. That's the language that Jesus spoke, Aramaic. No. That's no. a known fact. Okay. How Jesus is a prophet, he speak only to the tongue of his people, Israel, and he speak Aramaic. You just said that. You said Jesus was sent to the Jews, and he speak the tongue of the Jews, and he sent to the last tribe of the people of Judah, and you just said that Jesus speak Aramaic. Right. How this and happened? Some, How this happened? Aramaic, this is the this is Arabic, the this is the contradiction. Aramaic, this is the contradiction for the Quran. Let, this is the, Abdul. Let me you, answer you. Your Quran. Let me you, answer you are the one who mentioned to don't me saying. Me, this child. <laughs> don't call me this child. You're acting like a child. Ima, Mr. You Imam, Mr. Imam, Mr. Imam, you are hired. You are hired in my mosque. We need a joker. You, you said. That as an example, Jesus to give me a proof that the prophet they are sent only to their nation to speak their language. You are the one who caught Jesus for me. You are the one who caught Moses. So now I'm asking you, how Jesus his book is a Greek word, and you said he speak Aramaic, but yet his people speak Hebrew. Okay, so uh, obviously you don't know the history of the Bible. Oh, the original okay. manuscripts, the earliest manuscripts. Uh huh. Yeah, I lost you. Hello. The earliest man is. Yeah. I don't know what kind. Of, are you still in the internet from your neighbor? This is why your internet is so weak. Because Muslims they do that always. It's halal. I don't hear you. Are you there? What happened to this guy? <laughs> I can't hear you. Your voice is gone. I'm here. I don't hear you. If you have any applications, close them. If you have many applications, close them, please. We don't hear you. Well, I'm still here. All right, start again. So you said I don't have the the history of the the uh, manuscript of the Bible. You said that. Right. Okay. What you continue, know, I'm, please? Let, I'm listening. Right. What you want to say? So, so let let's go ahead and calm down a little bit, shall we? No problem. I'm, I'm listening. So, so what? what I, I don't understand. I don't understand the history of the I'm, Bible. I'm, what does that mean? What does that mean? I don't understand the history of the Bible. Yeah. Okay? What does that mean? Call so, me. the original manuscripts, the original manuscripts of primarily the New Testament mm -hmm. are written in Greek, right? Mm -hmm. But known fact, it's a a fact of Christendom, of Christian scholars themselves, mm -hmm. that Jesus actually spoke Aramaic, mm -hmm. and, and he spoke some Hebrew because he was around Jews of that time. Mm -hmm. He spoke primarily Aramaic. I mean, uh, yeah, Aramaic, mm -hmm. and he spoke some some Hebrew. Mm -hmm. But the scriptures themselves didn't come along and didn't develop until 
many years after Jesus. So why your so why your God he is adopting the names which is made by the Greek, not the name which is gave. What is the name of the book Allah He gave to Muhammad to, to Isa? He gave him Injil. He gave him the Injil, the gospel. But the Injil is a Injil yes. is a Greek word. It's not a Greek word. It is a Greek it's word. an Aramaic word. Okay, let us say it's Aramaic for the sake of argument. The verse in the front of you it says that and you are the one who told me that Isa was sent to the Jews speaking their language. Correct? Right. Is the language of the Jews according to Islam is Aramaic or Hebrew? Aramaic and Hebrew. Islam teach that? Wait, 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 you can show me that. Can you show me? It, 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 Islam doesn't have to teach that. No, it it's, says that's, that's because, no, because it's in the front of me it says that. It says we sent not a messenger except to teach in the language of his own people. Right. Right. Okay. His own people so, spoke so, Aramaic okay, Hebrew. So, all right. So, so it's common sense. All right. So all right. But the name, but the name of the gospel is in the Greek. It's not even Hebrew. It's not even Aramaic. That's not in the Greek. The Injil is going to be in the in Arabic and Aramaic. Aramaic friend, is the my, my sister friend, language my of friend, Arabic. My friend, this the Injil is, is Injil is not an Arabic. Uh, I mean, a Greek word. It is a Greek word. No, it is not. Are you Actually, sure? Actually, no, it is not. Where do you get this from? Where did you get it from? I, it's it's just simply not. You can sure search any dictionary in a second. Search it. Get the searching. <laughs> the Inge Injil uh, is not. What, what Doctor no, Moore not. he said to you about the word Injil? Doctor Moore, did he say anything about the word Injil? Where do you get this from? Are, are, are you going to just be silly? People are, are laughing at you. People no. are laughing at you. People are laughing at you. Now let us go back to the topic. Your prophet, yeah, let's go back to the topic. Your, the word in your, is your not pro, the no, it is your prophet. He is saying that only messengers sent to their own people. Now, right. the question is, your prophet, he, very are, you, are, you, are you from the Arab? Are you from the Arab? It says, do you see that Quran in front of you? It says his own people, his own people. So Muhammad, he was sent to his own people, was not sent to you. He was sent as a mercy to all of mankind. What? What the mercy? He said, uh, uh, "You know, uh, the, the mercy of mankind he have is his sword." No, he didn't. Really? The word "sword" is not revealed anywhere in the Quran. Oops! I don't know oops, where oops, you, oops, oops, the word oops, "sword." Oops. The word the Quran does not have the word "sword" in it. I don't know where you get this from. Really, the, really, the, really. Okay, this is in the Hadith. Right, it says absolutely. that in the Hadith. Right. It says, but what I just said is, it's not in the Quran. Where? Okay. What is what is the, the word Quran? sword is not in the Quran. People like to try to say that the word sword, Islam is spread by the sword. Islam, uh, the the word sword is not in the Quran. Okay. So, okay, hold in on, regards hold on, to hold answering on. your question, let me answer your question, uh -huh. and try, I'm going to try to break it down, and make it simple for the layman. Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So, so, Prophet Muhammad was sent to the Arabs. Why? Because the Arabs at that time were very a big linguistically meaning they were doing a lot of poetry and they were very very well known for mm -hmm. their poetry mm -hmm. and so what happened Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala uh, let me give give you two references Moses in the time of Moses uh -huh. magic was big Oof. magic was big That's in amazing. the time of Jesus peace of be upon him uh -huh. uh, medicine medicine was big what is the medicine so what, in time what, of what, Jesus no what, hold on. what is I'm the time no no no, no. don't 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 what is the medicine in the time of Jesus no don't jump don't jump don't jump what was the medicine what was uh, I'm going to get you busted what is the medicine was a practice in the time of Jesus to make it unique what is that I don't know. I don't understand what you just said. You you're said trying, what you're trying to do be, is because not you said you said you said you said medicine in the time of Jesus was developed or whatever. Right. What is that? What you got very, from? It was very prominent. Where? Greek where? Medicine where? Who said that? In the who's, Romans, who's, adopted the Greek medicine okay, is Muhammad, very prominent. Muhammad, so let, let, me, let, let me explain. Listen, let, listen. Let, let, Jesus, let me give you an answer. Did Jesus use medicine? Did Jesus? Did Jesus use medicine in his miracles? Did he use use medicine? Let me explain. Did what I was Jesus to explain. use medicine in his miracles? Yeah. Did he use medicine, or it was a miracle? I didn't, I didn't say anything about that. What you did? You, you Why you are comparing what I'm Jesus trying, did with medicine? Then? Why question. you are comparing I'm, Abdul? I'm, Why you are comparing medicine with the miracles of Jesus if Jesus never gave medicine? I didn't say that he gave medicine. So why you I are comparing him with medicine? Why? If what? What, if you, what the if medicine? You quiet, have a little bit of what, self-discipline. What the medicine? What the medicine have to do with Jesus? Jesus never well, gave medicine. I'll, I'll explain it to you if you be quiet. Can you do that <laughs> just for a few seconds? 
Okay. In the time, uh, of Moses, magic was big. So uh, our God, our Creator, Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, uh -huh. gave, gave the miracle of allowing the staff of Moses to uh -huh. turn into a snake and swallow up the other snakes, uh -huh. and to okay. part the Red Sea, and to strike the rock, and, okay. and water gush forth. That uh -huh. was his miracles to address the people mm -hmm. of that time that were real big on magic. Now Jesus, <laughs> medicine was real big during that time, with the time of Jesus. Uh -huh. It was very prominent. Romans, Romans were adopting the Greek medicines, uh -huh. and they were. it was very prominent at that time. What did Allah do? He gave uh, Jesus, peace and blessed be upon him, the gift of healing to override and make and to uh, outdo the man-made uh, uh, stature and man-made claims of greatness. The, the workings of Allah through Jesus and through Moses outdid the magic and the medicine of their time. But, In the days of Prophet Muhammad, mm -hmm. linguistically through the poetry, it was very fluent and, and very well known. The Arabs were very well known for their linguistics. And what did Allah do? He revealed the beauty of the Quran that has been unmatched for over 1400 years, never been altered or changed in any way and outdone and actually set the uh, uh, criteria for the Arabic language. Wow, all, the, all the criteria for the Arabic language is now comes from the Quran. Also, hold on, it was revealed in the Arabic language because the Arabic language is easy to learn and to recite. So a man from Houston, Texas, hmm. that is white as can be, that did not grow up in the Middle East, mm -hmm. can learn to recite the Quran in Arabic. But that you, way, but you did, but you did not. But God you did not learn heard. Arabic. You are lying to yourself. You did not learn Arabic, and Arabic is very hard to learn. You are a liar. It's not oh easy. Is Arabic is easy? Well, is Arabic is easy? Yeah. Is Arabic One easy? You say it. Time. Everybody is saying. Every, everybody heard you saying. Arabic is easy to learn. Listen, listen. Let me let me let me get you. Let me get you busted, guys. Hold on. Shut up. Shut up, idiot. He said that Jesus in his time medicine was very popular. So God he gave him miracle of medicine, but Jesus did not use medicine. And there's no medicine in the world can make somebody resurrect people from death. And there's no medicine in the world can put some mud in the eye of somebody and give him eyes again. What does this have to do with medicine? The Arabic Quran, which the Muslims, they are so proud about, and this guy, he is a stupid idiot. It says in the Quran itself that the Arab, they make fun of the Quran. They were not astonished with it. Read with me what the what the Arab they say to him. They said, "In هذا إلا أساطير الأولين." They did not believe in it, and they laugh at the Quran. Is تطلع عليهم آياتنا قالوا قد سمعنا ولو نشاء لقلنا مثل هذا. If we want, we can say the same. Read carefully, guys. Chapter eight, verse number thirty-one. It says, "We heard this, and it's easy. We can make the same." We can say the same. This is and this is the, the, and the story in there is the same as the ancient story, fairy tale stories. Do you see it? They said to him in his time, "What a big deal about this? You know, we, we can say the same." So the Arab they were not impressed with the Quran and they were laughing at the Quran, accusing Muhammad of copying of fairy tale stories of people uh, before him. Now I'm going to give the mic to Mr. Abdul and I will ask him very question, a, silly, a silly question: If Muhammad brought the Quran nobody can make like it so what is the satanic verses which Muhammad he received the mic is yours uh, there's no need to talk about the satanic verses yes he Muhammad he received wait, satanic wait, verses you and you wait, said to, and you said nobody so can have Quran you know, like Quran what you're trying to do because you have no ground to stand on mm. is you're trying to bounce around from any topic that you can no, uh, we are not. To, you are the one. You are the one who. You are the one who say. I ask you about Muhammad being the prophet of the Arab, and the Quran confirm that there is no prophet sent except to speak in the language of his people because he is from the people. Bilisani Qomi. So there's two conditions. He has to be from the people and speaking to the people. Okay, let me ask you a question. What the Quran says about what is the reason to give the Quran in Arabic? What is the reason? Do you know? Yes, in order to preserve the original words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. No, God, no, that's a, that's a lie. Which verse that's is saying? Which, which verse, which verse is saying yeah. to preserve the word of Allah? Where it says that? Which verse? It says it in the Quran that, that Allah. Where, Allah where, where? You are an imam. You just quote for me a, you just you just quoted for me a verse in the Quran. Can you tell me where we can find it? You can find it. Where, where? Tell me where. You just quoted for me Quran. Don't play games. Right. Where it says, right. I sent it the Quran, up. so it's Allah going to be preserved. Preserve the, the the Quran 
until the day of judgment. This is not what you say. This is not what you said, kid. This is not what you said. You said that Allah is in the Quran in order to preserve the Quran. Where, which uh, verse says that? He, I said that he promised to preserve the Quran until the day ah, of judgment. Okay, so now the question about the Arabic. Focus with me, please. The Quran was sent in Arabic. Right, because it's to, easy to learn. For, is that what the Quran says? Because it's easy to learn. That's why. Yes. I never heard of any human being says Arabic is easy to learn. I am. A, I am an Arab guy. I am. An, I am an Arab guy. I am an Arab guy. I spent all my life studying Arabic, and when I write, uh, uh, if I write a letter, I will make errors. And the Quran is full of errors. Listen, 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 listen. Don't, don't, don't be, don't be dumb. The Quran says the Quran. The Quran. Stupid. He want to sing for me, an idiot. He must be. Uh, he must be high. Guys, look at this Quran. The Quran said. That Allah He sent the Quran in Arabic so you might understand. This donkey He said to us because it is easy. <laughs> Arabic is easy. <laughs> in chapter 12, verse number 2, it says the following Abdul. Listen carefully, and I will open the mic for you. Inna Quranan Arabian What does that mean? The mic is yours. Brother, I, I can't I speak. Don't call uh, me brother. Don't Arabic. call me brother. Answer. What? Are that you not mean? a brother in humanity? No, I am not, not a brother. brother. No, because Muslims, no Muslims, they are a liar. Muslims are You're not even to... allowed. Muslims are you not are allowed. Wrong. Are not allowed to call non-Muslims a brother. That's mean you are practicing taqiyya. That's me. not true. That this is, is not true. true. This is a true. This is this is a true. Man. Okay, then read for me chapter five, verse number fifty-one. We are brothers in humanity. No, we are not. We are not. We are not. We are not. We are, we are not. You don't accept my calling. Don't, don't, you brother, don't, don't, you don't, I don't want, no, I don't want you to call me brother because you are a hypocrite liar. Now answer, answer. You, don't, I have love don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. Don't talk about you love. Don't talk about love. Your God. You have hatred in your heart. Abdul, Abdul. Because you're hatred. Let, let me shut you up. Let me shut you up. Let me shut you up. You said, you said you are a convert from Austin, correct? Or Houston? From Houston. That's okay, a, no a problem. Revert, not a and, convert. And you said, and you said, and you said, Islam teach you to love others. Is that correct? Absolutely, and I do love you. Okay, okay, that's why okay. I have okay. Let us see if this is true. Let let us see if this is true or not. Chapter nine, verse number twenty-three says you cannot even be friend with your father and your brother from your blood. What do you say about that? Not if they're uh, speaking against Islam. If they're fighting those. A second ago, or, a second ago, you said not, to me you love me. You idiot! You liar! A second ago, you said to me I love you too. You said to me I love you. I speak against Islam. Let shut me, up, idiot. Shut up, liar. Guys, did he say a second ago, I love you too? Now I said to him, the Quran says, it teaches you to hate your family and you cannot be friends with them. He said, eh, if they are speaking against Islam, yeah, you know, but I am speaking against Islam. And a second ago, you said to me, you love me. I didn't say that. So why you cannot be, why you cannot love your father and your brother in Islam? Well, sure you can love your father and your brother. No, you cannot. That if they're not Muslim, not to love your father and your brother. You cannot. My father, my father is a Christian. I still love my father. You cannot. I okay, read for me the verse. Okay, I challenge you to read the verse. Chapter nine, verse number twenty-three. Go ahead. You you read it. I don't. I don't have. I did I'm read not, it for you. I did read it for you. I did. I just did. Uh, so your your understanding <laughs> is is my is, friend, not my understanding. Is, Do you want me to show you the interpretation of the verse by the scholars? Uh, do you want me to show you? you. Abdul, let me, show, let me get you busted. Let me get you busted. Let, you, you, uh, let me tell you something. My father is a don't, Christian. Don't tell I me something. Father. Don't tell I, me I, something. I, answer. Don't I, tell me something. My brother is a Christian. Your father is ashamed of you. Now answer. The Quran says you cannot. This is the interpretation of a Jalalain. Do you see it? This I, is a Jalalain, Abdul. Do you see what a Jalalain is saying? Do you see a Jalalain? Do you see a Jalalain? Stupid. Do you see it? You cannot choose them as a friend for you. Who? Your brother and your father. For they chosen not to believe, over believe. So shut up. Stop lying to yourself. This is Tafsir al Jalalain. Do you have a comment? If we if you were in face to face as men, yeah. I doubt very seriously that you would tell me to shut up like that. Why? What you, so you, 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 you will beat you me? You will beat me? What you would do? What you would do? You will beat me? What does that mean? I, I wouldn't beat you, but, I, but I, I'm but i sure that... Okay, I, then I say to you, shut up. Then shut up. Otherwise, make a threat if you are a man. Make a threat if you are a man. Make a threat. Me in 
make a threat if you are a man. Listen, you are a potato. If you are a man, make a threat to me. What does that mean? If I am in front of you, you will not dare to say to me, shut up. Who are you? What I'm telling you is that if you... You are a potato. Are you going to kill me? Are you going to kill me for saying to you, you are a false believer? Is that what you would do? I don't believe I don't believe that you're the type of man that would look me in the face and tell me to shut I will not look you in the I face. Don't. I will look you in the ass. This is your level. Now answer. This is now, the this now, is the interpretation. Now, this is the interpretation of your prophet, and this is the interpretation of the Quran. You cannot take your friends. You cannot take your friends from your father and your brother. Why? You are you lie to me? You says it's not teaching you to love. Right. Absolutely. Absolutely. We Why? love everyone. Why not? You are a liar. You cannot take your father as a friend. Why you are why you are lying? My father is my friend. My father, he's my best my friend. Abdul, friend. Abdul, Abdul I'm quoting you for Quran, chapter nine, verse number twenty-three, and this is the interpretation made by Muslims. Right, but you have to read the verses before. My and friend, the verse after I can right no problem. Time. Go ahead and it's read six. ten verses before and read twenty verses <laughs> after, and this is the interpretation of the verse in the front of you will not change anything because interpretation for the verse is interpretation for the verse. I'm not right. giving you my own. It's talking about those who are oppressing the Muslims at that time. Abdul, so no. Your father, no. Your father, listen, your listen, brother, listen, or, listen, listen. Or, okay, listen, oh, listen. No, you listen. Listen, you listen. You are a liar. Show me what it says. Show me what it says in the interpretation. Those are oppressing the Muslims. Can you show it to me? Uh, those who are oppressing the Muslims. If you don't have an understanding about that, mm. then you need to read a little bit more. You need to learn, open your mind, and learn how to study. Uh -huh. it's to those who okay. What about what about people. chapter five, verse number fourteen? What about chapter those five, verse number fourteen? People. What about chapter five, verse number fourteen, where Allah He said they will okay. spread hate. Allah will spread hate between the Christian. What do you say about that? Allah will target your word. father. Allah will target your word. father, your family. And he will spread hate between them. Chapter five, verse fourteen. Can you read for us? You read it. I don't have the Quran. What's wrong with you? you keep saying right? to me, you read it. You are an imam of a, of a mosque, but you do not know a verse. I'm not. What do you want me to do? Rem remember every verse. Every, you, you, uh, are, you are. You are watching YouTube. Every... You are watching YouTube, aren't you? No, that's. I'm not. I'm sitting here with the phone in my lap. I'm not on the internet at all. Uh, uh, okay. I'm, all right. All right. Okay. Okay. All phone. right. In chapter five, verse number fourteen, Allah He says. That he is going to spread hate and enmity between the Christians. What do you say to Allah? Allah knows best. It's so, Allah's wisdom. He Allah, knows what, he's what is the wisdom? Person. Okay, I want to learn from you. I want to learn from you. What is the wisdom? What is the wisdom to spread hate? What is the wisdom to spread hate? What is the wisdom, Abdul? What is the wisdom to spread hate between the Christians? What is the wisdom? Why, why do you keep calling me Abdul? Because you are Abdul. Aren't you? Don't you aren't you the Abdullah? I am Abdullah. So you are Abdul. Now continue. But what is the wisdom? What is the wisdom? What is the wisdom to spread hate? What is the wisdom to spread hate? Abdul, Abdul, what is the wisdom to spread hate? I'm I'm asking you, I insist. You could not give me a quote from Dr. Moore. Can you find me the answer of Dr. Moore about Allah and the wisdom of Allah and the science of Allah to spread hate in earth? What is the wisdom of that? To commit more crimes so people they will kill each other. People will rape well, each other. What is the wisdom to spread hate? Explain to me. Well, what you need to do is you need to read the verses before. I did. Verses no after. problem. Go ahead. Read 10 verses before and 10 oh, verses good. after. I challenge you. Well, go ahead. Read it. You've got the Quran. It's in the front of me. It's in the front of me. It doesn't say anything. Allah, he hated the Christians. That's all. Read it. Read it. What? It's say I did. So I did. Time. All people of the book, there has come to you, a message, our messenger, revealing to you much as that you used to hide in the book and passing over, etc., etc. And then the verse before it says, from those who too call themselves Christians, we took a covenant and they forget a part, good part of the message that we sent to them. So we string them with hate, enmity right. and hatred between one to each other. What is that? Why you lie to me? You right. say Islam, you know Islam ordered you to love the Christians. If Allah, He spread hate between them. It's it's not say, saying hate between the Muslims and the Christians. It's hate but hatred between between who? Between the Christians. Ah, so, so guys, your the, context, your context, guys, the guys, the good, the good God Allah, the good God Allah, He have a target and a mission to spread hate between the Christians. And what that will do is that a good thing to spread hate between the Christians? Do you like Allah to spread hate between your brother and your father who they are Christians? Is that what you are saying to me? 
let, let me, what I'm going to do, I've got the Quran in my hand right now. Uh -huh. And I'm going to go ahead and give you a lesson, okay? No, answer so this. Answer this. Ask, no, don't give me a lesson. Answer, like answer. Teacher. Do you like do you your God? You, you said you did like, you did lie to me. You did lie to me. You did lie to me saying that you are a convert and your father is a Christian and your brother is a Christian. No, so the question is, do you accept your God Allah to spread hate between your father and your brother because both are Christians? Do you agree with well, that? Let's, let's, go ahead, let's go ahead and read this, okay? Mm. It says, from those two who call themselves Christians, we did take a covenant, but they forgot a good part of the message that we sent to them. Mm -hmm. So strange them with enmity and hatred between the one and the other uh -huh. to the day of judgment. Okay. And soon will Allah show them what is what it is that they have done. O people of the book, there's come to you our apostle, revealing to you much that you used to hide in the book. Mm. and passing over much that is now unnecessary. Uh -huh. There has come from Allah mm -hmm. new light and a perspicuous book mm -hmm. wherewith Allah guides all who seek his good pleasure to ways of peace and safety and leads them out of darkness mm -hmm. by his will to light and mm -hmm. guides them to a path that is straight. Mm -hmm. So let me let me ask you, brother, and listen to those verses. Mm -hmm. Do you hear anything about hatred right there? Yes. Do you feel yep. you know, Yes. anything or or do you hear yes um, yes yes or, yes 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 it says clearly he will spread hate and enmity what's wrong with you what do you want more do you see the word with enmity and hatred what do you want more? right okay okay do you, so do you, so do you agree do you agree I, I want a clear answer from you please let, let us not play games do you accept your god to spread hate between your father and your brother and your family and your mother because they are christian do you accept that no that's not what it means so what it's me that's but it's that's, it says that's that called, it says from now and from now until judgment day from What's now it me. says does it say from now until judgment day it says until okay. judgment day so whoever a christian until judgment day okay. allah will spread hate between them what you're using is what's called a straw man fallacy you're trying to read something into the text that is not there what you're you under you're limited understanding your inability that, to does understand this, okay hold on hold on said. okay let us do this let us do this my friend let us do this what about we go and read the interpretation what do you think how about we do that? Okay, which intubation you want? Uh, uh, anyone you want. It doesn't all right. matter. Okay, let's go. Chapter 5, verse number 14. And we will yeah, see all of those who they are in English, and we will see them. All the one in English, no problem, just to be fair. All right, here we go. Yeah, do that. Okay. Tafsir al-Jalalain. Tafsir al, -Jala al, -Jala Tafsir al -Jala Look with me carefully in the screen, please. Tafsir al Jalalain. And with those who say we are Christians, this is semantically connected to, the, to, uh, to what follow. We made covenant as, as we did with the children of Israel and, the, and uh, the Jews. And they have forgotten a portion of that where they reminded of the gospel or in the gospel, uh, pertaining to faith and other matters. And they do pork the covenant, broke the covenant, sorry. So we have three steered up. We have caused among them enmity and hatred until the day of resurrection. What do you say? You just read the same verses that we just read. This is the interpretation. Read the interpretation. This is the interpretation, my friend. It's in the screen. <laughs> oh, I thought you. I thought you was reading the commentary. This is the commentary. Me, me, what I can do? This no, is the commentary. That's not, that's not commentary. This let is. Me, it's in, it is in the screen. It is in the screen. Everybody can see it. This is Tafsir Al Jalalain. Do you want to see the link? Do you want me to send you the link? Here we go. Let me send you the, not, this is the commentary that, of Al Jalalain. Everybody is my witness. I'm reading. Read I'm reading for you. This is Al Jalalain. Because there's nothing to add. Allah will spread hate between the Christians until the judgment day. It's very simple. This is Tafsir al-Jalalain. You can look in the YouTube right now and you will see it in the screen. I'm not making things up. Let me show you Tafsir ibn Abbas. It's the same. The cousin of your Prophet Muhammad is saying the same. It says, and those who say, Lu, we are Christians, i.e. the Christians of Najran. We made a covenant in the gospel that they should follow Muhammad B B U H B M W Mercedes Benz and manifest his uh, his his traits and not worshiping anyone or anything except Allah or associate with anyone with him, but they forgot the part they left a part of what, uh, therefore they are admonished uh, with which with, uh, they were commanded. Therefore, therefore, listen carefully. We have a st a st a streared uh, uh, up. Uh, we have cast enmity, killing, destruction, and hatred in the heart among them 
between the Jews and the Christians and it says uh, between the Nestorian of Nigeria etc blah 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 so what is that well look you gotta look at history and, and history proves it to be true so just you, look at history uh, the history uh, proves uh, that the devil uh, oh, okay. let me, let me do, you, do you believe in the devil okay. do you believe in the devil let me, the let me, devil ask, you that. Let me ask you let me ask let you me let me ask you do you let think me, do you think if question. i I'm do you think do you think do you think, do you think if somebody showed somebody in the street this is from god or from the devil it's actually from god and let me explain to you what it means ah, okay are you ready from, from god well, guess what guess what okay like you like you, hmm. uh, Hitler was a Christian, right? No, he what was he, not. No, he was not. He was beloved he was, by Muslims. That's a lie. That's a lie. Hitler, he made fun of the Christians. Hitler, he no, killed the Christians. Hitler, and the Muslims, Hitler, they fought in the army of Hitler. The Muslims, they fought you're, in the you're, army of Hitler. Now, the, now the, you're the, the, big, the biggest, the, the biggest brigade, the biggest, the biggest, look up, the biggest, the biggest SSS brigade liar. The biggest BSS leader, they are from Al Bosnia. Okay, and let me ask you, let me ask you. Muslims from Al Bosnia. Muslims, Abdul. Muslims from Al Bosnia, they fought with who against who? I'm, I'm not going to change subject for you. <laughs> you are the one who you are the one who mentioned Hitler. So don't talk about Hitler. He, Hitler, you Muslims, you love him because he killed the Jews. We are what the I'm one who fought Hitler. Again, you all, you, all the again. Arab, all the Arab, they love Hitler. Now go back to the topic. Your prophet, by the way, is a lot no, more what? criminal than Hitler. Hitler, he did no. not rape anyone. Hitler did not rape. Your prophet, he was a rapist. Don't change the topic. Now, he, now answer. Uh, Abdul, Abdul, oh. it is you Muslims who killed the six million Jews. The Muslims, they fought with Hitler side by side. They are the one who burned them alive. And your really? prophet, as long as you are talking about killing the Jews, did your prophet say that time will come and a Jew hide behind a tree or a rock and the rock and the tree will say there's a Jew behind me kill him? Yes or no? Well, apparently that, that happened because six million Jews were so killed. So this is your prophet order. This is your God order. Are you agreeing that Allah is the devil? A second ago, you were accusing me to be Hitler, but now we found that it Hitler, he was, he was the rock and the tree of Allah and he was calling the, the, the Muslim to kill, and kill the Jews. Uh, apparently, you don't understand your inability to comprehend. My friend, what you read. answer is it why? Why Allah saying that you should kill every because Jew in this earth? I thought no, you love the Jews. Do you, do you love the it's Jews or you hate the, the Jews? Answer, please. Uh, Mujahid, Mujahid, do you love the Jews or you hate them? Do you, them do you love Hitler as a Christian? Do you love? Do you okay? So now you are saying, okay, guys, be my witness. This guy is saying that Allah he made Hitler, he is a Christian. Hate the Jews and kill them. Do you say that? Are you saying that? That's what they did. He created no, he didn't make them do anything. Man has a freedom of choice. No, 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 no. He said no 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 no. The verse the verse it says the verse says Abdul shut up shut up son of a muta. It says we string them. Who is the one saying we Allah? So don't fool yourself, and you are the one who said, obviously, Allah, he made them say, do, do that. So you are saying Allah is, a, Hitler is the servant of Allah. Now, as long you admitted that Hitler is serving Allah, how that Allah is a good God by killing and making war. Second so uh, second war is the worst war in, in the history of humanity. People kill each other. And you just admitted that this war happened because Allah, he is string the hatred between the people. The mic is yours. I not say anything you just said. You said you that. Said all Everybody, the, it's recorded. People, they, they, people, they will hear it. It's recorded. And it is recorded. It is recorded, liar. People, they can just right. go a few seconds back and they can hear you. You are the one right. saying, obviously, it happened. Allah, he made that happen. So Hitler, he killed I the Jews. Okay, happen. who I is the? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get you busted. Let, let me You're get you. Your mouth. Shut up. Let me get you busted, right now, right here. Your prophet said that a human being, he have no control of his deeds, and. What Allah wrote for him is going to take over. So Hitler, he did what Allah planned for him. And let me show everybody how stupid you are, who you claim that you converted to Islam, but you are just an idiot. 
Guys, read carefully with me. If we ask this guy, the sin of Adam, did Adam do his sin willingly or he have no choice? The mic is yours. Look, I'm, I'm going to take 30 seconds to answer As, this question myself. Okay, Adam, Adam, to answer Adam, the Adam, Adam, did he do his sin willingly or it was unwillingly? Let me tell you something. Allah has given man the freedom of choice. This is another question. I want, I want a specific make, answer. I want, I want a specific answer. Adam, did he commit his I'm, sin? I, Willingly listen, or not? Listen, I'm, listen, asking, I'm giving you a specific answer. No, no, you, you are not. Mind. You are not. Adam, did he commit yes, his sin? I'm, Willingly I'm, or not? I'm gonna answer you. What okay, I'm gonna answer your question about Adam. All right. And you need to give me 30 seconds to do so. Okay. Okay, so shut your mouth and give me 30 seconds. Shut your mouth, Muhammad. So okay, you shut uh, so so Allah mm. has given man the freedom of choice. He's not going to make anyone believe, and he's not going to make anyone disbelieve. Where is he's going to give them a result of what, don't don't interrupt me. I don't see it's Adam. It's a matter where, of law. Where is Adam? It's a matter of law. Don't don't interrupt me. Where is Adam in the it's, story? I want Adam in the story, please. You said you want to answer me about Adam. Question about Adam. If no. you would shut your mouth. Mm. Shut up, your okay. mouth, Muhammad. Shut up. Okay, go ahead. So if if a man chooses up, one Muhammad, thing, a Muhammad, certain thing is going to happen. On. It's the laws of cause and effect. Uh -huh. So if you choose to do right, good things are going to happen. If you choose to do wrong, uh -huh. bad things are going to uh -huh. happen. Okay. Everything in this life is a test. The law is not going to make you do anything. Uh -huh. Okay. So with Adam, he did not make Adam do anything. He didn't make Adam do wrong, right. nor did he make Hitler kill the, ten, the six million Jews. Mm -hmm. As are you He done? did not make them do that. Are you but done? because he did that, okay. because of their their disbelief because mm. man chooses to do wrong because okay. man make makes bad decisions then certain consequences take place okay. so because the jews and the christians during the time that those verses were revealed were rebelling and oppressing the muslims and refusing to believe they didn't want to listen just like they didn't want to listen to, to moses they didn't want to listen to noah so they drowned okay, they didn't want to adam, to uh, they didn't let's want focus to on adam stay in adam stay in adam yeah adam. i'm getting to adam i'm yeah. getting to adam well, you don't know you no, no, you answer already. You said Adam, he did choose his sin willingly. Yes, correct. You said that Adam, he chose willingly his sin. Correct. Adam. What? Adam chose to do what he did on his own. Okay. Will. So anyone? Allah okay, hold on, hold on. So anyone who say the opposite is stupid. Do you say that? If someone he says Adam was forced to do his sin, do you say he's stupid? Do I say? The I don't one, understand your question. Okay, you if, saying, if somebody him, believe, if somebody believe that Adam was forced to do his sin, do you think this is a stupid to believe? Uh, I think it's a mistake. yes, Adam wasn't okay. forced to All do right. his sin. Okay, please listen to me carefully, guys. He said yes. He agree. The one who believed that Adam he was forced to do his sin is a stupid, and this is a mistake. I didn't. I didn't use the word stupid. No, you I said yes. You said stupid. yes. You said I yes. Said that is no mistake. problem. Okay, let us focus with the word mistake then, because now he insists it is a hey, mistake. Okay, Let's focus on this that. is your prophet saying that Adam was forced to do his sin. So and you what, just where does it say that it at? says that in the front of your eyes. Let us show you. Okay, so if he was forced to do that, who was he forced to do that by? By the Allah. By Allah. By Allah. Not by Allah. He was forced to do that by the whisperings and the acceptance. Abdul. Of the Abdul. Of Abdul. He was. He, listen. Abdul, don't he be was stupid. To by the whispers. Stupid. Read what your prophet said. Show respect, you idiot. I just get you busted like a turkey in the Thanksgiving day. Now you said it is a mistake. Stupid, stupid. I, I will a make you famous, a Mujahid. Mujahid, potato. You are famous already. People are dying from laughing. Here we go. Read, uh, read with me. Read with me, fine. Abdul. Potato, read with me. Well, Europe, let me read for you. Shut up. Shut I'll up. Shut up. Of Islam. Sh and a lot shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Now you know you got busted, so you will talk like a turkey, right? Stop. Read with me and laugh at yourself. This is your prophet reporting a debate between Adam and Moses. I want my son. Shut up, you back. idiot son of Muta. Stop talking. You think you are going to over or intimidate us by high voice? You just admitted that your prophet is a stupid and everybody heard you. You said this is a mistake. Stupid believe. Read with me carefully. You are muted, by the way. You are talking to yourself now like a donkey because you are. 
Adam and Moses held dispute. Moses says to Adam, who is talking now? The prophet of Islam, the prophet of Allah, the prophet of Allah. And this hadith is sahih. Read with me carefully. This is a sahih hadith. Sahih. Sahih. Read carefully. You said it's a mistake, huh? Ah, you just accused your prophet to be stupid donkey. Adam and Moses held a dispution. Moses said, Adam, you are our father. You deprived us and caused us to come out of paradise. Adam said, you are Moses. Allah chose you for his speech and wrote the Torah for you with his hand. Do you blame me for doing deed which Allah had decreed that I should 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 do 40 years before he created me so adam got better of moses in argument you idiot you just got your prophet busted your prophet believe that adam he won the debate and adam was forced to do his sin by allah the mic is yours Why are you Answer. Why are you talking like a six? Answer. Because you are the six years old. But don't, did you guys? Did he say six years old? Your prophet wife, she was six years old. Why then, if six years old is why bad, set up idiot. Why you say to me? Why you are talking like six years old? That's mean I am a child, right? So why your prophet he marry a child? Then the mic is yours. Oh my goodness! Do you want me to talk about answer? Answer? No. Answer? Why you call me six years old? If this is a shame it's to speak like, like a six years old chair? So why a prophet of God? He is fifty-four years old, having sexual relationship with a child. She is six years old. Just, just as anticipated, your intellect is. You not are wrong. stupid. Now you are trying to escape. Don't say. Don't. No. The more you if talk, we, the more you do. We people. Were, if we the were more, in an actual live controlled debate. Yeah, I'll what you will do? What you will do? What you will do? I'm getting you busted. Who actual? This is actual life. You, you idiot. This is actual life. This is actual life. You just said the one who believed that we're Adam was standing. forced. Hold on. The one who believed that Adam he was forced to commit sin. He is an idiot. You said that. So now explain to me. Why, why, why uh, you're a prophet Tom is an Trump idiot. Answer, no, answer, no, answer no, Abdul no. Potato. You are famous already. No, people, no. They will, people, they will take this video and post it everywhere. You are busted. You just admitted your prophet is making a mistake. How you do no, that? I, I never said that. You said that. You said whoever no, believed. Mistake, you, mistake said, you, you said, you said, you said, it is recorded. Who You said whoever believed that Adam was forced to do sin, this is a mistake. Adam was forced to do sin by shaitan, not no. by Allah. Read with me carefully. Your prophet don't agree. So you are saying your prophet is a liar. Muhammad, peace and blessed be upon him, did not say that. He Allah said that. He said, no, Adam. he said, no, he said. He said, Adam, he won the argument. He won the debate. Adam, he said to him, do you play me for a sin written by Allah for me 40 years before my creation? So Adam, he got better argument from Moses. This is what your prophet said. Brother, look. Look, look. Adam look, was deceived. Look, Adam. Uh, what? Adam was deceived by Shaitan. No, your prophet says the opposite. Adam your prophet, my friend, your prophet says Allah, He is the one who wrote the sin of Adam 40 years before the creating Adam. What hadith is that? I, I, I'm, I'm showing you. Okay, let me show it again to you. This is, I can show it to you in many books, and this is Sahih. Everybody can see in the screen, guys. The, do the word Sahih appear? Is the word Sahih appearing there? It is there, right? It is Sahih, volume number one, book number one, hadith number 80. This is Sunan Ibn Majah, and this is a Sahih hadith. And again, we can show it to you in Ibn Dawood. We can show it in other books. I well, heard Abu Huraira. One thing is for certain. One thing is for certain. I don't hear you. What? We lost you. Uh, okay. What? What? Tips to deal with person. In saying that, in saying that, despite what hadith you're reading, mm -hmm. okay, uh -huh. one thing that you're not going to read in this hadith uh -huh. is that it's not going to say that Allah caused Adam. To it says sin. that. It says Allah that. Are you deaf? Are you are you deaf no. or what? Are you deaf or yeah. what? Let me read for yeah. you. Yeah. Stupid. Stop. Stop. Guys. Does the hadith says it clearly that it's Allah who caused this to happen? 
Let us read again for this guy who claimed that he speak English. Adam said to him, Oh Moses, Allah chose you to speak with, and he wrote the Torah for you with his own hands. Are you blaming me for something which Allah decreed for me 40 years before he created me? Why you are saying you will not see in the hadith? It says it's Allah who made them do that. Do you speak English or not? The mic is yours. I need just 30 seconds to answer your question. Read it. Okay. Hmm. You stop talking for 30 seconds, and Read. I assure you, you will not be able to do that. Right, right. Um, okay. Shut up, Muhammad. Muhammad, shut up. This is seconds. not me, by the way. I have two personalities. Sometimes I am Muhammad, sometimes I am Adam. And right, so you so, so you've got a split personality, right? Got, yeah, yeah, because Muhammad, okay, let me ask you, let me ask you a question. This is a private question. Sometimes I imagine myself having sex with my wives, but in fact, I never did. What do you think my problem, brother? You got problems far beyond that. What, what do you think the problem if I am having this problem? I imagine myself having sex with my wife, but in fact, I my wife, she, I, I, she I, never, I don't want to talk about you, you and sex with your wife. But do you think this Let's, is this? Do you think this is a do, do you think this is not appropriate topic? Do you think it's not appropriate to talk about it in public? I, I don't think it's appropriate to talk about it in this conversation, it has nothing to do with what we're talking okay, about. Okay, but what do you think of me having? I don't care about you having sex with your wife. No, I want to advise really... you because I am suffering from a problem. I I imagine I, myself having but, sex with my wife, but the fact I did not. Well, that, that's your problem. I, I, so do you, not, so you think it's a, so addressed. you think you think you agree it's a problem. Well, I agree. You might need to see a psychiatrist for a multitude of okay, reasons. Okay, thank you very much, guys. He said the one who had this problem, he have to see a doctor for obviously he have a mental illness. So how you explain to me your prophet saying the following, and his wife saying the following? That the prophet he imagined himself having sex with his wife, but in fact he never did. Maybe he had a dream. I don't know what Hadith is no, talking about. No, it says that he was. Oh, that it says it says it says he was bewitched. He it says like you're going to find any it says any Abdul, question. Abdul, Abdul, try to bring Abdul, that up. it says it says listen, listen. A second ago you said a second ago a second ago you said I need to see a mental doctor. Your prophet is the one who is suffering from this. Shut up, shut up. You are an idiot liar. You do not know your prophet is suffering from this problem. So a second ago, I should see a doctor. Now it's okay. Huh? Maybe it's a dream. It is not a dream. Read what his wife she's saying. You are muted, by the way. Don't talk. The prophet continues for such and such a period. Imagining that he slept, has sexual relationship with his wives. In fact, he did not. The mic is yours. Right. See how you're going all over the place. Well, I with, I get I get the answer. I got you busted in Adam. We are done. No, we, I I never did get finished answering the question. You said about already. Adam. You said already. You said already. Whoever believed that Adam forced to commit I sin is a stupid. Your like, prophet. Your prophet is a stupid, according to you. Thank you very much. You said that the hadith in front of me. Do you want me to give you the Do you want me to give you the hadith so you can read it for us in your side? Let me let me give it to you. Hold on. Let me no, give you. I don't need it. I no, 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 you need it. No, 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 it's not, no, no. It's not issue. my friend. I, I, a, I insist. I insist. I want you to read it. Go ahead. Here we go. It's read, a, read it a, for it, me. Read it for me. I insist. I insist because maybe I'm quoting you know, wrong. Maybe I'm my English you. is bad. Maybe my English is bad, man. I mean, come on, read it for us. Go ahead. What, what I would like for you to do is try to grow up just a little bit. I don't want to grow up. I want to stay six years old like Aisha. And lose some of the hate. I want to stay six years old, the big and the hatred in my heart is is the reason for it. Is it chapter five, verse fourteen? So blame Allah. Don't be stupid. Allah is the one who bit hatred, put hatred in the heart of the Christians according to Islam. So stop. How blaming. about you and I schedule a, a controlled Stu live stupid, debate? With a stupid answer. Answer. Now, how, how you said to me? How, how you said to me? You are trying, to, Abdul. Religion. You are trying to escape the humiliation. You are humiliated already. You call me, you thought you can get away with it. This is a Christian prince. You cannot do that with him. You said it's a stupid mistake to believe that Adam was forced into sin. You're a prophet. Say the opposite. So I want you to say loud and clear, Muhammad was stupid when he said that. The mic is yours. Saying that your ignorance is a, a, a huge problem. What is the ignorance? And I, I challenge you. Read for me. To a Why you don't read? Live. Why you don't read? I Why, you. Why you don't read? I challenge why? Christian print you are challenging me. You are we are I, I, I already got you busted. I already, already I burned you. What what life? We are life. We are life, Abdul. What are you talking about? Answer. Don't change the topic. Don't you can challenge me as much as you want. You are a joke. You don't even know how to read two words in the Quran. Challenging me. 
at least bring me someone who speak Arabic you idiot how you say whoever say that Adam was forced into sin he is making a mistake and he is a stupid you just insulted your prophet explain to us live debate explain to us why you ac okay. why you accuse your prophet to make a, a huge mistake he have a wrong no, understanding of Islam why no I didn't say that I said you say you said that you said it's a mistake you said it's a mistake be honest you you said that and the hadith in front of you it says it says it clearly it says guys does it say there uh, uh, Muhammad said thus Adam won the argument with Moses so your prophet believe that Adam was right and Moses was wrong what I am saying is that your understanding is a mistake no problem my friend obviously this is not my understanding I'm just reading what your prophet said Abdul, it is a problem. Oh, you're understanding. Abdul, what Abdul, what's wrong with you? Look, look, it's your prophet saying, Thus, Adam won the argument. Thus, Adam won the argument with Musa. It's not me saying that. I did not say anything. It's your prophet saying that the winner in this debate is Adam. Let me tell you something. Don't tell me something. Okay. Don't tell me something, please. How your prophet says that Adam he won the debate if he was wrong. In regards to debate, I challenge you to open. Don't you, no, you cannot. You debate me already. You already. You already burned. You are no one. You are just a kid. You see. You see. I'm. I'm, I'm, I'm allowing. I'm allowing you to speak to me. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. I'm allowing you to speak to me, even though you are no one, because we want to have fun. That's the whole story. Islam is a stupid religion, and you are the joker here. The hadith in the front of you, and I challenge you not to change the topic and run away and hang up. Your prophet said uh, that Adam he won Adam he won the argument and you said this is a mistake. Well, the mistake is with you. Read and it. And the read, thing is, you keep the thing, the subject. The thing is, the, the you, thing, don't get, you don't get a full answer. You don't wait for a full answer. Give me the answer. Abdul, you're, give you're me the answer. Did you say you it's a mistake? The logical and a good answer. And so you divert and so you speak over I think I think let me tell you that let me tell you what let me tell you let me tell you what happened you speak over listen people listen and you interrupt and you my divert. friend my friend and you speak over my, and you my friend my friend I told you that I have a problem I imagine myself having sex with my wife and you told me to see a mental hospital but when you learn in a second that this is what your prophet suffering from suddenly it's maybe a dream but the hadith doesn't say it's a dream. This is something Muhammad he suffered during daytime and never was a dream. It was a black magic. Somebody maybe took some hair from his ass and he controlled him by a remote control, which is a hair remote control. You are a hypocrite man. What is right is wrong. What is wrong is right. When you learn that the one is doing that is your prophet, suddenly. Imagining yourself sleeping with your wife, but you are not doing that. It's just a dream. But a second ago, it was you should see a doctor. When I asked you about Adam, you said, <laughs> you know, do you think really Adam was forced to commit sin? Whoever say that, he is making a huge mistake. And this is stupid. And when I showed you that your prophet says that, you don't want to talk about it. Why? The mic is yours. Let me explain something. Explain. I've been talking, talking to you about it. And I've been trying to answer these questions. You did not. And you continually interrupt me. You did not. Okay. If, okay. You know what? I'm going. I'm go, I'm, every, okay. Every, guys, every, guys every, let us make a deal. Let, hold on. Let, let us make a deal. Let us make a deal. I want you to read the hadith by your voice. I will give you 10 minutes. 10 minutes. I will not talk as long you don't change the topic. Do you promise? Don't speak for 10 minutes. Do you promise? I will not. As, as long you don't speak. I don't. As long you don't change the topic. Do you agree? You won't speak for 10 minutes. 10 minutes, as long you don't change oh, the topic. Do you agree? The topic, the topic is the, from what? The you, topic, is the, five the, or six the topic, the topic is the hadith about Adam committing sin forced by okay. Allah. Okay, let's keep it there. Let's let's talk about that. You okay. want to? Open the, hadith. open the hadith. Okay, yeah. open the hadith and start reading, please, and then explain to us. No, I'm not going to open any hadith. I don't then, have a hadith. Then, then shut me. up. No, I gave it to you in, 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 in Skype. If the link is there. You have no excuse. I, I'm not looking at the, the you have to look phone. why not the click why you don't look why you don't look why are you in the bathroom no I'm not in the bathroom. so why I you don't look phone in my lap okay so what so what the phone in your lap uh, click at the link and read it how we are going to explain to me the hadith without reading I, the hadith are you an idiot 
I'm not going to explain to you the hadith. So what? Uh, give so what? You are going to explain to me, then, stupid idiot, guys? I told him I will give you ten minutes as long you read the hadith for us and you explain it. And he says, "I'm not going to read it." So how you explain something you did not even see? Are you stupid or what? I don't need to read. Why you You've already read, read it? Ah. Want me to read it again for me? No, you, no, you know, no. I want because to... because I don't understand it according to you. So I want you to read it. How about you give me I, ten minutes? You I, if you read it, if you read it, start with reading. I know. How about you? no? I want your voice to be recorded, reading this hadith. You got it? I want your voice to be recorded, reading this hadith. The ten minutes started, and you start your first minute by or first five minutes. It's up to you how long you take the hadith to read. Maybe you are slow like your prophet. By saying it was narrated that. You understand? So if you don't start with that, I will cut you off. So start reading, please. Ten minutes start right now. It's nine ten p.m. my time, your time. It was narrated. You continue. The mic is yours. That's not going to happen. I don't have the hadith. Then shut up. You have the hadith. You liar. I give it to you in Skype. You are a liar. I gave it to you in Skype. Don't tell me I don't have the hadith. Let me show everybody. Oh, it doesn't bring up the let me sh let me show I'm everybody. This I'm is on, this is your Skype. Skype. This is your Skype. You let idiot. Yes. Yes, I show it to you in Skype. Here we Just go. Ev everybody can see Skype. Guys, is the hadith appear in the front of this guy? Do you see it in the screen? This is your Skype. Everybody can see I posted the hadith for you, so you have I, no excuse. I, Start reading I, the hadith. Why you are making a problem you, about reading I'm, the hadith? What's wrong with you? Why don't I read it? Telling you that I, I cannot see the hadith. All I see is the little symbol for your for your. Uh, it says debate TV. That's all I see on my phone. My friend, no, you there. see, you see. You okay, okay, let me. The, okay, okay, the, okay. Hold on, 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 potato. Hold on, hold on. Hang up and click at the link. You will see it. Hang up. Hang up. Here we go. Here we go. I just posted the hate again for him. Here we go. I will show you guys in the screen. Do you see it? Do you see it? His name? Mujahid Kibi Moore. And this is the hadith in his Facebook. Don't tell me I did not give it to you. Liar. Don't say I did not. Now, let us talk again. Sick people. He's not answering. Answer, answer. Hello? Yes. Yes, Mr. Mujahid. Now you get the hadith, you have no excuse. Read it for us, please. Well, yeah, let's let's go ahead and do that. You want okay. to? Okay, go ahead. I'm listening. Well, let me let me bring it up. Okay. And then we're, then I'm going to take you to school. Okay. Oh, so you okay. give it. You give me ten minutes before the the, the, the bell rings. As long okay? as long you don't change the topic. Be careful about. Well, no, I'm not going to change the, the whole topic. story. Is about you, Adam no, and on, the hadith. Hold on now. Okay. You you're in class from this one moment on. Mm. You're in class. You be quiet. Mm. I'm going to take you to school. Okay. Okay. You ready? I'm ready. Should I bring okay, my so Should I bring my sandwich? What? No, because you're not going to eat in class. You're because no, I am six lunch. years old. Six years old children they eat in class, as you know. Ask Aisha; she will tell you. She had better experience. That's a red herring. Mm, red That's herring. A... What does that mean? Red herring. You're right. You have no idea what that means, do no, you? No, I don't because know. Your, your intellect is not. You're you're not on level with me, brother. Oh, so guys, this is red herring. I I don't have a level of ham. What does that mean, red herring? Yeah, you don't know what that is. No, I don't know. Tell me. So what? What? What red herring mean? No, explain to me. What does that mean, red herring? You look it up. You look it up. What? What is that? You want me? What do you want me to teach you? You want me to teach you everything? What red herring mean? What red herring? Science. You want me to teach you about the Hadith? You want me to teach you about the Quran? You want me to teach you about Christianity? You want me to teach you about the Bible? Abdul, Abdul, you cannot teach me about two words in your Quran. You do not even know how to read the word correctly. Actually, I will. Okay, read, gonna have read and let us laugh. Read, read the hadith. Read the hadith. Let us laugh. Remain silent, okay? Hmm. You remain silent. 
I heard Abu Huraira narrating that the prophet said, Adam and Musa debated. The Musa and Musa said to him, Oh, Adam, mm -hmm. you are our father, but have deprived us and caused us to be expelled from paradise because of your sin. Adam said to him, Oh, Musa, Allah chose you to speak with, Allah chose you to speak with, and he wrote the Torah for you with his own hand. Mm -hmm. Are you blaming me for something which Allah decreed for me 40 years before he created me? Mm -hmm. Thus Adam won the argument with Musa. Thus Adam won the argument with Musa. Now don't don't talk. Don't talk. Now what I'm going to talk to you about is the laws of cause and effect. Okay? <laughs> and so what, what I'm going to use is the example of someone that is a coach on a sports team. And, and this coach has a someone that he wants to play on his team and he tries to force him to play. Okay. He tries to force him to play. What good is that going to do the, the coach or his team to force him to play? He can't force him to do anything oh boy. for the, by the laws of cause and effect. If he forced him to play, then it would be, he'd be putting his team in a bad situation and he, he would lose games. He would lose the season in the matter of laws of cause and effect. Allah has, Revealed in the Quran oh, that oh, he oh, allowed oh, Shaitan oh, and it says that because you have sent me astray, it says in the Quran, if Shaitan took it to Allah subhanahu wa saying, but you sent me astray, I'll buy a white man on your straight path, and I will attack from before him and from behind him, from his oh, right and left. You will not most of them thankful. You will not find most of them. We pray in Islam, we say. And hold on, hold on. Your, your, your voice is gone. We cannot hear you. Your, your voice is gone. What couch and what game? And your voice is gone. I'm not interrupting you, by the way. Your voice is gone. We cannot hear you. Are, are you there? Are you there? Hello? Yes, are you just interrupting me? Are you trying to. No, your voice is gone. We cannot hear you. Even now, it's cutting. We cannot hear you. People are my witness. So, well, can you hear me now? Okay, I hear you now. What couch? What the couch have to do with this? Allah is the couch here. I didn't think about a couch. Yeah, no, you speak about uh, the uh, laws of cause. Uh -huh. You said the football. I said, no, I said the laws. You said you said a, you said a fall uh, like a uh, football something. What happened? Who is the one? Uh, can you repeat again what you said from the beginning? Because well, your voice was what was we were losing your your voice. Can you say it yeah. from the beginning, please? Can you use it from the beginning? I'm giving you extra time. Don't worry. Yes. Uh, say it from the beginning, uh, please. Go ahead. Okay, I will say it from the beginning. Can you hear me? Yeah. Can you hear me just fine? Yeah. Okay. You, you from said, the beginning. You said the word coach. Coach, correct? There's from a coach. The Did you say the word coach right. in the beginning? Who is the right. coach? Who is the coach? Yes. Who is the coach? Allah? Hold on. Let me... Let, let me... Don't interrupt me. No, no, in class, no, no. I'm not. I'm not, I'm not interrupting you. I want to know what do you mean by co coach. I don't want to waste my time right, later. Gonna, who is the right, coach here? Right, the and coach? I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell you again from the beginning. Okay, who, if but, you would shut up. But if you don't mind, please okay. explain to us who is the don't coach in this story. Who is the coach in the story? Explain to us, please. Listen, listen. Okay. What's wrong with you? You said the word coach. I want to know who is the coach in the story. Don't tell me. Don't throw words without explaining. Who is the coach? Is that Allah? The mic is yours. I'm going to explain. Do not interrupt me again. Okay, start with coach. Okay. I'm going to start where I started initially. You don't tell me where to start in my lesson. I'm giving you the lesson. You're uh -huh. sitting in school, uh -huh. and I'm going to take you to school. Uh -huh. Okay, so you listen. I'm the okay. teacher. I'm You're listening. The, Who is the coach? Who is the coach, you idiot? Who is the coach here? Are you calling Allah as a coach? Listen to what I'm telling you. Who is the coach? Answer. I'm going to answer your question. Who is the coach? I want to know. Give me his name. In this story you gave me, who is the coach? Is that Adam? Is that the devil? Is that Allah? Who is the coach? Let me explain to who you. Who is the coach? Oh, Don't explain. Just give me the name first and then explain. Who is the coach? No, is that Allah? You know. You yeah, gave me. You, you a stupid idiot. You don't dare even to repeat what you said. You just describe Allah as a coach. And what happened to Adam is a football game, and Adam he and, and Adam and Moses are playing soccer with Allah, and he is the coach. How dare you, you idiot! How you compare Allah to a coach of football? The mic is yours. Right. Okay. Be quiet and show me some respect. You're gonna respect me as I don't a man. Do, if I, you don't I don't. Do I don't respect you. Who said I respect you? I don't respect fool.
You're a foolish man. No, you just describe no, your you, God. Look how me. look what you did. You describe Muhammad as a person who make mistake and he's stupid. You describe no, Allah as a football coach. This is what you no, did. This is what you did. You said you said whoever believed that Adam was forced to do sin, he is making a mistake and he is an idiot, <laughs> stupid. And now you are comparing Allah to a football coach. Can't give me ten minutes, can you? Uh, you just can't do it. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to start again. Start, right? but, uh, but, forget, but don't, but don't about, forget. But don't, about the coach. but don't forget. But don't forget. Start. I want to do, not. Don't forget the couch. The coach uh, uh, story. Who is the coach? Please. Right. Go ahead. I'm going to talk to you about the coach. If yeah. you would who be is quiet. Okay, no problem. Who is the coach? I'm, I, you're gonna find you're gonna find that out if you would be quiet. No, I cannot find out I, I, because you see, I'm not smart like you. I want to know his name. You give me. I know you. The story. The story did not tell me anything. I want to know what. He, who is the I'm, who is the coach in that story? Be quiet. Who you're is the like coach? Yourself. We are you're, you're we are not smart. That you see, the Muslims who believe that Allah will give them endless penis are smart people. The Muslim who believe Allah will give them wife, her ass is one mile. They are smart people. I'm smart like you. So who is the coach in that story you told me? Is that Allah? I'm gonna gonna let you know as soon as you shut your mouth and let me finish explaining it okay uh, okay I'm so listening. go ahead and be quiet for, uh -huh. and give me the 10 minutes that you say okay. that you could be quiet but please I'm please talk about please with adam yeah please I'm start from about the... adam and yeah. answer your question about adam right. for the 10 minutes and right. i'm not going to change the subject like okay the, 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 don't forget please the coach story please we like it i'm going to talk about the coach i'm going yeah. to talk about the coach okay you're like a, you're like a child that just you you, you want your 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 pops yeah you yeah six years old like Aisha yeah yeah and I imagine okay. myself having sex but in fact I never did too right, those are red herrings don't, those are red herrings don't forget those are don't, topics. don't forget that don't forget that hmm. okay so here we go you ready all right so <laughs> in the laws of cause and effect that our God our Creator is set in place you do believe in God right our Creator right are you reading an article do you no I'm no hmm. I'm this is me i'm speaking because you how believe you, in our creator because how you can yes, you how you can repeat the same words again twice if it's not an article because it's me saying it i'm uh, it's me saying it. Wow. that's why it's if, my thought okay so if we search now in google for the word you just said we will not find an article about it absolutely will not man, okay, you're, go ahead. you're pathetic okay man. go ahead go ahead. Really go ahead go ahead go ahead go ahead in the laws of cause and effect that allah subhanahu wa ta'ala our god our creator has established if you choose one thing, a certain thing is going to happen. A, th a certain action is going to follow. One action is going to create a reaction. Mm -hmm. If you create, if you make a, another choice, another uh, set of circumstances is going to take a place. Okay, so <coughs> equate that to a coach who is the coach of a sports team, mm -hmm. and he has a person that he wants to play on his team, mm -hmm. and he tries to force him to play. Well, what good is that going to do? It's not going to do any good because it's going to actually be a detriment to the coach and the team because the play person is playing half-heartedly. Mm -hmm. I bring this up because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us in the Quran, there's no compulsion in religion. Mm -hmm. So Allah is not going to force us to do anything, but he has established certain laws of cause and effect to where if a man follows the straight path, mm -hmm. then good things happen in this life and the next. Mm -hmm. And if he follows, he doesn't follow the straight path, then other things are going to take place. And sometimes in life, man is going to make mistakes and he gets off the straight path. And by the laws of cause and effect, he turns back to Allah. He gets back on the straight path. It's laws of cause and effect that are all dictated by man's choice. Okay. So, and that includes the prophets, peace and blessed be upon them all, that we believe that we're actually sinless uh, in regards to the types of sins that we create as normal human beings. That's another, that's a totally different topic of discussion. And back to Adam. So Adam chose to do what he did because of the whisperings of shaitan. In our prayer, the last verse, the last chapter of the Quran, the last surah of the Quran is surah al -Anaf. And in that verse, those chapters, we say, we seek refuge in the, the Lord of humankind, the God of humankind, the deity of humankind, from the whisperings uh, 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 of the shaitan, basically. So we, we, we seek refuge in Allah from the whisperings of the shaitan. Okay, so... These whisperings of the shaitan is what causes man to make the choices that he makes to do wrong, to do evil, to do bad things. So uh, it boils down to laws of cause and effect that Allah has established that he doesn't make a man do any bad thing. But if that man chooses to do that thing, certain things are going to transpire. I mentioned earlier that Hitler killed the Jews. Well, Hitler killed the Jews not because Allah 
told him to do it or made him to do it. He did that because th that was something that was uh, that was a, a choice. Those were choices that man has made. People of Sodom and Gomorrah, as mentioned in the Bible, they were choosing to engage in homosexuality. Allah dealt with them accordingly. Okay, I'm not talking bad about any homosexuals. Of course, in Islam, we don't agree with homosexuality, but I'm just using that as an example. Mm -hmm. Anytime, so the the, the, uh, the Pharaoh and, and the Romans chasing the children of Israel, they chose to chase the children of Israel, and they drowned because of it. The people of the flood of Noah, uh, they chose not to listen to the prophet Noah, peace and blessings be upon him, and so they drowned in the flood. Laws of cause and effect. Are you done? Once, are you uh, done? Oh, no, I'm not done. You because because minutes. you are ignoring something very important. Your uh, your prophet no, said. You're, no, I'm not ignoring you're a, anything. No, your prophet I'm not said. No, I, no, I want you to go to what your prophet said. Don't give me a speech about things that have nothing to do with my topic. Your prophet hey. said that Adam won the argument. What does that right. mean? That's what I'm getting to. But you can't interrupt me in in the midst of my conversation. No, tell me what does that mean. Don't answer. don't you go can't and speak about me in the what, midst what, of my what, answer. What what Goma Mamora have to do with this? What Hitler have to so, do with this? Answer so me. What, for what us, I told you, I promise you, I will not disturb you. And so you and divert, divert, don't divert, speak about don't things that have nothing to do with Adam. Focus in Adam's story. Strip it. I told you, as long you don't speak about anything except Adam. Focus in Adam. The story of Adam is enough. We do not need uh, Goma Namora. So, your prophet said Adam won, which means the excuse Adam he gave was right. The mic is yours. What I'm telling you, I'm going to answer your question about Adam if you give me time to speak. Don't answer my question about Adam. I want you to shut up your prophet because he is the one who said Adam is right. The mic is yours. Well, answer the way you, you want me to answer. You're not going to understand. I need to be able to break it. I don't care if I understand or not because I will not understand the Muslim. Muslims are crazy people. Your prophet said Adam, he won the argument. How he won the argument if if Adam was wrong? The mic is yours. Let me, okay, let's see what the Quran says. It says, for those who disbelieve, it matters not whether you warn them or will not warn them. They will not believe. Allah said, <laughs> Over their hearts. Let me tell you how stupid this phrase is because this phrase Muhammad he said to the unbelievers and later they converted to Islam. That means Muhammad was a stupid fool when he said that. As an example, all those who they are Muslims in the time of Muhammad, they used to be not Muslims before when he said that verse. So that verse was a false prophecy that they will never believe. Now, answer how Adam is right when he just said, Do you blame me? For what Allah he decreed for me 40 years before my creation. He did not say for what shaitan decreed for me. He said what Allah decreed for me. There, Mike. Right. Through the laws of cause and effect. Those of cause Allah, and effect. Allah gave, allowed shaitan, uh, shaitan when he would cast out of paradise. <coughs> he told Allah, he said, because you sent me astray, I will lie and wait for man on your straight path. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Did you say that Allah, he said, him. did you say that Allah, he led? Satan astray. I, that's what the Quran says. Okay. Because he's so Allah. Them astray so because Allah. He okay. Cast him out. So because okay. he cast them out of paradise. You okay. Oh, no, 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 no. The shaitan. The shaitan. You said the shaitan. The shaitan. You said. You right. said. You said. He, you, you said. You said the shaitan. He was deceived by Allah. No, he was cast out of paradise because no. he sent him astray. Okay. Let me ask you. What, you what is what is verse? What is the verse? You, cast him away. What is the verse you are reading from? That it's Allah, this, uh, Surah Baqarah. What Surah Baqarah. Look it up. What? No, it says, me. because you, because you have cast me out, because you sent me astray, because you set me away. What verse? Sent me out of what verse? What, what verse? Because you threw me down. What verse? Um, how do you want to term it? It's same. what verse? What verse? I want because to show. I want to show everybody in the screen. What verse because, are you quoting for me? What verse? Because you kicked me out of paradise. What verse? What verse? Hey, good, man. Look, Google, because you said Don't me tell me astray, Google. Don't tell me Google. Me you are you claim that you are an imam in the mosque. Either you are a liar or you do not know what you are talking about. You heard this from somebody. So what verse, what where in the Quran it says that? You know what? You are you are a, a, a real character, man. <laughs> Why you don't give me the verse? You are an imam. You claim to be an imam in the mosque, but you do not know where you can find the verse you just quoted from me. 
I know the, I know the verse by heart. Okay, brother. So where, I know the verse. By so heart. Where, what verse? You what understand? verse? You know what? By okay, say it to me. By, say it to me by heart. Here we go. I'm listening. Uh, it says, "Because you have cast me out, mm -hmm. I will lie and wait for man on your straight path, and I will attack from before them and from behind them. And you will not find most of them thankful. You will not find most of them to be dutiful to you." Mm -hmm. Okay. What, so what, what this means is okay hold on hold on, hold on. Uh, what it's mean this the, the verse you read for me is wrong it doesn't say that oh my goodness gracious yeah okay. it actually does okay, say then, that. okay. Do, give, me, give me the go, give me the verse number so we can love <sighs> brother look it up on google don't tell me you? brother i'm not your brother you're a muslim your brother in humanity. You can be rude and insulting if well, you'd well, like. Well, Muslims, a, Quran, Quran says that we Christians are animals. So why you are a brother in humanity right, right now in the debate? Actually, the Quran says that you will find those who have most love for you. To abrogated, you call abrogate, most abrogated. Muhammad, he said, kill them all. He said, kill all those who oppress, who what oppress press? anyone. The, the Christians in Mecca never oppress anyone. The Christians he says fight those, they, he says, fight those who fight no, you. No, he says, yeah, those who don't reject Islam that's, fight them. Who what them who, fight that's those who right. fight you? Who fight who fought Muhammad? Muhammad he sent a letter to the, the Caesar of the Romans saying convert or else. There you go again, uh changing the subject. Now let us go you by the topic. Let's go to the topic. Abdul, Abdul, Abdul. Let us make it you simple, you idiot. The verse is so clear in the front of my eyes. Your prophet said that Adam said. Do you blame me for what Allah decree for me? You said shaitan decree, but here he did not say shaitan is the one who made me do that. He said it is Allah. Do you know what Allah mean? By the laws of cause and effect. What laws of cause and effect? You eat it. He said, right. do, you, do you blame me for Allah? He didn't say shaitan. Brother, you, you, you who is the don't... one who is the one who calls who is the one here in the story? Who is the one who calls Adam? Okay, let me let me show everybody how funny you are. Listen, if you are a Muslim, when you go to heaven, you will go to heaven because of what? Because what Allah decree for you, or because of your deeds? Repeat the question. You, as a Muslim, when you go to heaven, you will go to heaven because of your deeds as a Muslim, or because what Allah decree for you? I will go to heaven based on the mercy and the grace of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. This is another question. That's what that's my answer to you. No, question. it's not the that question. Is the so the are you saying the Quran lying? Because the Quran I says those who do good I deeds, the Quran says those oh. who good deeds, they will have heaven. Those who right. say who, okay, so based on the Quran, it says those who do good deeds and do righteousness, yeah, they people will go to heaven. Deeds. So people can, do good deeds all the time. Okay, but that doesn't that's not the only uh the only criteria. The question is make, the question right. is okay. So the question okay, is okay, why somebody will go to hell? Explain to me. Let me go. Let, let, let they, me rephrase this. Let, 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 let me rephrase the question. Why somebody now, will go to hell? Now you change the, no, I'm not changing the topic. I'm not changing the topic. I'm getting you busted. I am get. I am getting you busted. You are today. You are my joker. Uh, you know. You are, don't try to run. Why we go to? Why we go to hell? Why? Why a Muslim might go to hell according to your knowledge? That's a straw man fallacy. Why a Muslim might go to hell according to your knowledge? Give me an answer, please. A Muslim, a Muslim won't go to hell. A Muslim is one who are you, submits. Are you sure? A Muslim, now there could be one that calls himself a Muslim, but unless he's of the Mukmin, which okay, is the true believer. Okay, let's make it more simple. Anyone why, title, why a human being, like why, a, why a human being, okay, a human being, he go to hell because of his sin, of his own chosen sin, self-willing sin, Sin he choose to do, or because of something Allah he decree for him. Because of the laws of cause and effect. So, he, so, he so you wrong, keep repeating the, the, the law of cause and effect. What is that? Is that physics? I'm asking you a specific question. Be be clear. Be, speak as an adult. Speak as an adult. Okay. When I why I will go to hell? Give me a reason. Don't give me the the, 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 the deck. I'm, I make it simple, my friend. Is it the yes. sin? Is it the sin of a human uh, being? You, Take him uh, to hell according to Islam. Yes. Is it the so, sin you do by you you, Abdul Beteto? Beteto is the sin you do by your choice willingly. Is the reason for you to go to hell according to Islam? Yes or no? 
of course. Why would it not be? Okay, guys, I want to be my witness. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. And you deviate from the path, then, you, then by the laws of cause and effect, that a law, is, is the, a law our God, our creator, has set in place, mm -hmm. if you make the wrong, wrong you are cutting, you are cutting. Say again, say, say again. We lost you, we lost you, we lost you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We lost you, your voice is cutting. Start from the beginning. What is the reason to go to hell? You said, of course, of course, what? Start again. Hello? Ron says, send yourself this. Yes, can you hear me? Your voice was gone. So you said to me, of course, well, does that mean you agree that we go to hell because the sin we do willingly? Hello? Allah, listen to me. Listen. Allah says in the Quran, they're on him. So, and chooses to do wrong. Your voice is cutting. Your voice is cutting. I hear nothing. We hear nothing. We hear nothing. We hear nothing. If you have any applications in your phone, I think you're opening websites, Muslim website, to give me answers to help you. We hear nothing. Let, let me tell you something. I don't need a Muslim website to give me an Make it simple. You're, 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 is, 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 the sin, is the sin we do? Is the sin I, we do? Have, Willingly. Is the reason Is the reason to go to hell? Question. I already heard the question. You don't have to keep repeating the question. I already heard the okay, question. Okay, I want the answer, please. Go ahead. Okay. The answer is real simple, okay? Hmm. If you're on a, on a path, you're following a map, and you're supposed to turn right, and you don't turn right, then you're going to be making a mistake, okay? And what is that mistake going to do? It's going to send you into, uh, you know, uh, a bad situation. So the Quran says, do not cast yourself into destruction by your own hand, meaning do not cause yourself, don't uh, cause yourself to fall into sin. Don't allow yourself to be manipulated by the shaitan to fall into sin. Do not uh, do things that are in the disobedience of Allah, or you do invoke uh pain and, and, and punishment upon yourself in this life and the hereafter. So a person's deeds and actions absolutely have a bearing on what happens in in on the day of judgment. But it's only by the mercy of Allah that we make it to, to heaven. So that means that a person could give to charity all they want to in this life mm -hmm. and give donations and all that, but that doesn't mean they're living in their life in the obedience of Allah mm -hmm. because just because they give donations and give to charity mm -hmm. that in, in one aspect of their life, they may be an adulterer, they may be a murderer, they may mm -hmm. be a rapist, a mm -hmm. child molester. There's a whole bunch of different things they could be. Mm -hmm. And so those one few acts of kindness hmm. and charity are not going to be enough to do it okay. a person has to what be is my what answer is what is my answer you see i'll give me a speech and then now i get no answer i understand nothing from what you're saying the answer is well, no that you have to be of the book men the true believers hmm. okay so if you're a true believer and you live in the obedience of allah okay then you trust in so let me, let me make it simple let me and let me make it simple let me make it simple if somebody believes right. that a child a baby child he's a muslim he's born of a muslim family is he going to go to hell or to heaven not automatically he's not going to heaven. Automatically will go to heaven. Are you sure? No, I didn't say that. I said not automatically. He's not, not going to heaven why, automatically. Why he will not no. go to why? He didn't he did not commit sin. Because he has to live his life in the obedience of Allah. So where he will go now? He's a child, he's a son of a Muslim man. You're he, saying that he died as a as an infant? Yes. If he dies if he died as an infant, yeah, he's going to heaven. So uh, there is no way anyone will believe in such a thing because that would be stupid, right? Uh, I, don't, I don't understand what your question is. You just say, are you saying you are, born, if you a newborn says, baby dies, yeah. where does it go? It goes to heaven. Who told you? The that? newborn baby goes to is, heaven. Is that, according to Islam? Is, is that according to Islam or according to you? That's that's a common knowledge. That's that's common sense. So you are saying to me the common sense. So anyone who speaks something else, he will be stupid. How can, how can a baby uh, that has com committed no sin be guilty? Your voice was cutting. Uh, say, say, upon itself. Say, again, say again, please, Mujahid. I didn't hear you. How come a baby what? What I'm saying, a baby that has committed no sin is sinless. Yeah. Therefore, the baby is born to heaven. That's common sense. So, but is that, is that based on Islamic teaching or you are just guessing? Uh, that's, I, I, I can't find anything in the Quran or the Hadith that say that in specific but i'm sure it's addressed somewhere hmm. uh, but so, if somebody so no, I mean, if somebody believes so if somebody believes that a baby infant he will go to hell do you think he is making uh, uh, a kind of a, a stupid argument why would a baby why would a baby i don't know I'm asking uh, you 
Yeah. One baby that died, an infant, go to hell. Well, That's like impossible. There are some religions, they believe that babies can go to hell, even if he's an infant. So do you think they are wrong and they are stupid? As a Muslim, I don't believe that. Okay. So, but this is wrong, right? As a Muslim, I don't believe that. Yeah, but is that wrong to believe that a baby, he will go to hell if he die and he's, an, he's a baby? He did not commit People sin? People can believe anything they want to. I'm telling you what I believe, and I don't believe that's to be the truth. Yes, so and, uh -huh, this is not the truth. This is false. Anyone believe? I'm, I don't believe me. As I'm speaking for me, hmm. I don't believe that a newborn baby that dies is going to hell. Why would it? Common sense and logic tells you that no, that's not the case. This, I, Why would it? You know, you keep saying to me, Maybe. me, me, I believe me, me, trying to separate yourself now from being an imam. So I'm asking you. No, I am a Muslim, and I'm telling you as a Muslim, okay. in my belief, hmm. in my belief, believe, I'm not speaking for all Muslims because there may be Muslims that think something different. I don't answer for all Muslims. I answer right. for me oh. as a Muslim, all right. and I'm telling you, me as a Muslim, okay. I don't. I, I want you to give me the opinion, goes, the opinion no. of Allah, well, according to Islam, not just you. According to Islam, if somebody believe there is a baby, he die, but he will not go to heaven. What do you think? He's wrong. Why would a baby that died? Don't tell me why. I'm not. I'm asking you a question. You are the Muslim. Uh, for me, I'm I already answered. I already answered. I'm not going to no, spin I, around. I want and you play to games. give me. Uh, a I answered your question. Okay, I, I don't believe. I, I want you to give me a, an answer I, I as a Muslim, not as me. No, I'm uh, telling you that I don't believe that. Okay, the correct Islam is that the correct Islam opinion, or this is your opinion? That is what I'm telling you as a Muslim. That's what I'm telling. So you. as a Muslim, this you, is, so this is Islam. Look into it so this is on that. So this is look into it. Okay. So this is. So Islam. this is. Based, I don't ask answer for all Muslims. I answer for me okay. as a Muslim. If a Muslim, and that's my if, if a Muslim, he believe in I'm this. Not gonna it, any, okay. I'm not going to answer anything else about the Shia. I'm telling, example, example. Hold on, hold, answer, hold on, hold on. Okay. I don't Mujahid, care what Shia Mujahid. anybody says. The Shia say. The Shia believe. Okay, hold on, hold on. If a Shia he believe. If a Shia, if a Shia Imam, hold on, hold your horses. If a Shia Imam believe that an infant he will go to hell, do you think that the Shia is teaching wrong? I would question that Shia about why he believes that, and I would have a conversation with him, a logical and peaceful and meaningful right. conversation. But, it, but you, with him about are you going to tell? Him, are you going to tell him? Are you are you are you willing to tell him it's wrong? Are you willing to tell him it's wrong? Do you have uh, I will tell him that I believe that he's wrong. Yes. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much, <laughs> guys. Be my witness. He just said. Finally, we made him say it because the one who said is your prophet, not the Shia. Let me get you busted again. This is your prophet. He said, Aisha. She said that a child who is a baby child who never commits sin, never ever commits sin, ever. He goes died. to hell. I don't believe that. Well, who care who do you? Your prophet. He said, if you don't believe, you became an apostate. <laughs> You're a prophet, no, you yes. said that. You're a prophet, said that. And you just said you don't believe in that. No. And thank you for leaving Islam, <laughs> my friend. Thank you for leaving Islam, my friend. Thank you, thank you for leaving Islam. Now let us see who is the who, let us see who is the coach here. Shut up. It is time for me to say to you, shut up. Co coach, huh? Let us see who is the coach here. Let us see who is the coach. What's wrong with you? You Muslims are a bunch of idiot, and anyone who convert to Islam, he is an official idiot, is stupid. Read with me carefully, and this is a Sahih Hadith in Sahih Al Bukhari, in Sunan Ibn Majah, in all the books. This child, the Messenger of Allah said, "You are muted. Don't talk." S A W was called for a funeral of a child from among the Ansar. Ansar are Muslims. I said, "Who is talking, Aisha?" Oh, Messenger of Allah. Glad tiding for him, which means the child. He is one. He is what? He is one of the little birds of Allah. Who never did evil or reach the age of doing evil. He said. It may not be so, Aisha, for Allah created people of paradise for paradise he created them for it when they were still in the father backbone and he created people for hell he created them for it which mean when while they are 
still in their father loins or their uh, backbone so here your prophet said that Aisha she is not saying an accurate statement this child not necessarily will go to heaven even though he confirmed that this child did not commit sin ever because Allah he decree his destination before he created him if you will go to heaven or hell so sin you idiot have nothing to do would you go into heaven or hell this is a child who never commits sin yet Muhammad confirming that he might not go to heaven why because Allah he decided who will go to heaven before he created him regardless of sin he will do so all what you told me about the coach and the game and all the stupid thing it was a joke this is a child from a Muslim father not a Christian father not a Jewish father he commit no sin he reached no age of sin but yet he might go to hell and you are the one who agreed that this is a stupid statement to say so why you say your prophet he is making a stupid statement your mic Well, what we do know is that there's some hadith that are authentic. This is authentic. Some, Don't play the game. It's authentic. authentic. Okay. Are absolutely okay. not authentic. Okay. Okay. Are, we also know. Okay. Hold, know. On, hold on. 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 Let me get no, you busted. You on. Let me you get on. you busted. No, you Let me shut up. Let me get you busted, guys. Does it say sahih? Does it say there sahih in the front of your eyes? Do you see in the screen? It says sahih. Why you are lying saying this hadith isn't sahih? Why you are a liar? Shame on you. This is your Muslim website. This is your translation. And it says the grade there is sahih. So shut up and admit that you have a following. Following a stupid religion does not make any sense. And you are the one who said to me, it does not make sense. It doesn't make sense that a child, he is a baby, he's an infant, he will go to hell. It's you who said that. Your prophet is a stupid idiot. Your mic. You know why? Because in it, we believe that we follow what's what makes sense and what doesn't. You don't believe in that. This is your prophet, and this is the hadith. Don't tell me we believe in that. Stop lying. This is your prophet talking. Are you disrespecting your prophet? We don't accept all of the hadith. You accept it. It says sahih. It says sahih in the front of your eyes. It is accepted. Let me let me explain something to you. Don't explain anything uh, to me. You did already. We don't have. You say you. you this is a, this is a sahih hadith. We don't accept all of the hadith. No, you do. You are a liar. You are a liar. You are a liar. You are a liar. You are a liar because you just you just said to me it is not sahih, which means if it is graded as sahih, then you accept it. And this is the grade given to the hadith by Muslims, not by me. You are a liar. You are just trying to escape. You've been humiliated. You do not know what to do now. Your prophet is getting you busted. Your prophet, he got you busted with Adam. There's no coach there. Adam, he said to him, do you play me for sin created for me 40 years before I was created? And here the hadith to confirm that Allah, he decreed for you before he created you when you are not even a sperm in your father. He hang up the coward. You want to debate a Christian prince? Are you sure? Are you sure? Why you hang up? Why? Did I hurt your feeling? Huh? You are he, this guy. He called me. He want to teach me. You know, he like he is good. This guy, he is proud in the front of the Muslims. He is going, guys. I'm going to uh, just wait what I would do with the Christian prince. You know, you know. I don't think you dare to say to me, shut up in the front of my face. What you would do? You want to punish me? You don't know who I am. You have no idea who I am. Don't go there. What you want to do? You want to beat me up? Do you think I do you think really I'm a coward? You see, guys, we don't debate Muslims. You have to trap them because they are not people of honesty. What co what coach? Coach and football? Cause of logic? What cause of cause and effect? What the laws of the laws of cause and effect? What is that? What cause and effect? This is a child. Baby. Bambino. He's a bambino. This bambino did not do any bambino sin. He did not kiss women. He did not 
Look at women. He is a bambino. Yes, bambino Mujahid. What do you want to say to us? Hello. Let me let me explain something to you. Now Don't that explain I'm back. to me why you are lying saying okay, this hadith is weak. Me? Why you are saying this hadith is weak? You don't even know what the hadith. Let, let me let me let me talk. Why you say it? Why you say it? Why you say it? Why you say you said that I was running? You got to. Okay, no problem. Let, let us see if you are running or not. Why you say it? Why you say it? Okay, listen, listen. If this hadith is approved by all Muslim scholars, I already know what you're going to ask. Is this hadith no, approved by all Muslim scholars? Yes or no? Is this hadith approved by all okay. Muslim scholars? Yes or no? I can't answer that question because I'm not right. all Muslim scholars. You are. You are. So what that's are a, you? What are you? You are Abdul. That's a, that's what are you? Bullish. What are you? What are you? So what are you? Yes. So your knowledge is given to me. Your knowledge is given to me as a Abdul only. You do not know what you are talking about. Is that why? This is why you are doing poopoo? This is why you are making a st you. stupid statement. Oh. Okay, how you are not a scholar, but yet you made a judgment that this hadith is weak. What I'm telling you is that I don't answer for all uh, Muslim scholars. It doesn't I matter. For me. Who is you? Who, who are you? Who are you? Who are you? You are no one. This is a this is a hadith exist in Sahih Muslim. Exist in. Quite a while. Uh, listen, so I'm someone you talking to yourself. Or this is to me? this is apparently a hadith. This is a hadith exists in all Islamic resource approved by all Muslims. Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you one of the Muslims? Are you one of the Muslims or not? Someone you keep running from is are you, what I am. Are you That's one of? I am. I'm a person uh, that you keep running from. I, I'm who, a person who, that you won't engage in a, a live controlled debate with what a moderator. Live control? Where you can have a period There's of time no, to talk and I love it this way. What moderator? Because then you will speak for ten minutes. You will say nothing. Muslims don't say anything. You will go. I, I have to. I have to get you busted. I have to trap you. I made you say things in order to get you busted if i show you the hadith listen if i show you the hadith from the beginning you will not say what you said you will not say it does not make sense this is the truth if i show you from the beginning this hadith that your prophet said that shut up if i show you from the beginning that your prophet said if i say if i rephrase my question i say your prophet he said that there's a child he died and he told aisha not necessarily he will go to heaven then your answer will change but now because you are in the corner and already you said to us that uh, you know this is uh, doesn't make sense this is stupid man he is a child he did not commit sin and he you know why he will go to hell this is what you said that is a common sense that is the logical that is justice that is justice why a child he will not go to heaven if he never commits sin that's mean everything in Islam is a false and fictions. It's not a sin you do. It is something Allah He decree for you before you are created. You commit sin. You don't commit sin. It doesn't make any different. As simple as that. Yes, Mr. Mujahid, what do you want to say? Why this child will go to hell? Hello. I didn't say the child will go. Your prophet, your prophet says so. Your prophet, who who cares if what you say? You say you told me already he will not. You're a prophet. He got you busted. He said no, he will go. No, no, no he didn't get me busted. No, you didn't do anything. But I did is catch you. I caught you robbing a bank earlier. Uh huh. And mm -hmm. you, where, you, where, you where, caught, you where, busted, where area? Where, where area? Where, where area? Where? Where? where okay, okay, okay. You, you cut me. You cut me robbing a bank area. Where area? Where area? What area? Where? Where? I know, but you know, right over there. Where, 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 where? No, you cut right me, right you cut me right in the bank area. Where? What area? Give me, give me. Wait, when, when? Which topic? You cut me right in the bank area. Bank, uh, huh? The IBC Bank in Los Angeles, California. That's that, there it was. Ah, so are you making and now? Not, are not, are, you, are you, No, what I'm telling you is that you're guilty uh -huh. and you're busted, and that's all there is to it. Really? You see how a lot. Do you think really is, after all what happened to you, Abdul? Listen, listen, you potato. Abedito, are you serious that after what we got you busted with, I am the one is busted? Are you sure? Yeah, you. But your prophet agree with me. Not with you. Your prophet agree with me yeah, about that. Robbing the bank. Your prophet agree. Just shut up. You know, just go go. You are just a kid. You are, you are angry now. Robbing a bank. You are a faithy Muslim. 
you are the one who robbed banks and you are the one who robbed houses and you are the one who kidnapped people from their houses ISIS are your family and your prophet himself was a thief do you want me to show you the fifth from every attack is for the prophet the best of the booty is for the prophet he make verses about them you are the one who robbed banks go to Europe and see the Muslims they are the scam of Europe credit card scam passport stolen passport then if you want to buy a stolen phone go to the Muslims if you want to buy a stolen software go to the Muslims go and check it out if I'm lying go and check it out if you want to buy drugs go to the Muslims I cut you red-handed my friend this is how stupid what reference this hadith is there's many hadith about this my friend this one is Sunan Ibn Majah and this hadith number very number one uh, book number one hadith number 82 let me post the link for you guys on YouTube poor guy this guy he will not sleep for the came in two weeks he just discovered that his prophet is a stupid and the sin the sin you do all the sin you do is made by Allah all of it Adam sin made by Allah the poor Adam he was kicked off heaven from nothing for nothing it was Allah game and the funny this guy he said to me that uh, you know uh, Allah the shaitan he said uh, because you uh, led me astray it doesn't say that that's a false translation because you're a donkey they did lie to you the same as Dr. Moore in chapter 7 verse number 16 this is the verse you are quoting for me you do not know where to find it you idiot it says because you deceived me shaitan saying to Allah because you deceived me this is what Quran is saying Allah deceived shaitan because you deceived me I'm going to deceive them so he is return it back because you deceived me not because he kicked him out of heaven he said that before he kicked him out of heaven you idiot not after when shaitan was a shaitan he was already in heaven and Allah did not kick him when he said that they kicked him after before so what he sent me astray he did not send him astray because you deceived me awaiteni awaiteni which means coming from fool me and tempt me with foolishness it is Allah who deceived shaitan that's in your Quran you know <clears throat> when you see those uh, who claim to be a Muslim convert as he claim and uh, destroy or not I, I right away I see somebody he is high with stupidity and this guy he will leave Islam just wait guys read with me read with me carefully this is the interpretation of the chapter he quote for me this idiot who could not even find it chapter 7 verse number 16 it says you just made me error error from guidance who is the one who made shaitan a bad person according to Islam Allah he is the one who made him do the sin shaitan himself is the victim of Allah chapter 7 verse number 16 and this is the interpretation of the verse in the front of your eyes because you did that to me I will do that to your people where is justice the poor shaitan he himself is a victim according to Islam You made me. Why Allah made shaitan in error? Did Allah say to him, I did not make you an error? No. Read the verses after and the verses before. Allah agree with that. And you will read that in verse number 18, in the same chapter, Allah told shaitan, get out of here. So he did not lead him astray as kicking out of heaven when he said that verse. Which mean when he said that verse he was not out of heaven as a stupid idiot he said 
because in verse number 18 Allah said to him well get out of here which again a stupid mistake in the Quran because in verse 18 he says to him get out of here and then in verse number 19 Allah told Adam and Eve live in the heaven enjoy the heaven don't eat from the tree and then in verse number 20 Shaitan he come to them but Shaitan already is out of heaven as in, as, as as it's reported in verse number 18 <laughs> this is what happened when you get a holy potato yes Abdul what do you want to say hello can you hear me? yes I hear you what do you think about chapter 7 7 verse number 16 the verse you quote for me Shaitan saying that Allah caused me to do error sin Oh man, what do you say? What do you mean by your question? How, in what context? What well, do you mean? The, the hadith in the front, the, the, the verse in the front of us says, Because you deceived me, you fooled me, you lied to me. This is the interpretation by Ibn Abbas, the cousin of your prophet. Read with me carefully. It says, Just as you made me err from guidance, who is the one who made shaitan err from guidance? Allah. How Allah did that to Shaitan? Well, let's think. Let's think about this logically, okay? Uh huh. So, it's a known fact, okay, uh -huh. that there are people who propagate lies and deceptions, okay. Mm -hmm. And so, and sometimes in the propagation of these lies and deceptions, mm -hmm. they misconstrue things, they reword things, they present things in a manner in which it's not. The true way in which it should be presented. I'm, I am and amazed. So, I'm amazed. And so, you did not use the word couch. I mean, what does this have to do? Answer me. It says there that you made me commit sin. Shaitan saying to to Allah, and Allah didn't say no to him. I did not do that. He agree. And Allah is no, the one who reported this. Because you sent me out of paradise. Because it doesn't say that you lie. It doesn't say that. Can you show me where it says you sent me out of paradise? You know what? Uh, if you can show me that, I'm going to close my broadcast right now, and I will you promise you. It. You better I'll... close it because I'm the one to shut you down. Okay, show me. Can't. Show you me. Then no you, you are a liar. It, Go ahead and it, close it. It is in the. You know what? It is you, in the screen. The potato. Potato. It is in the screen. I got you busted. This is Tafsir Ibn Abbas, the cousin of the Prophet, and you are a liar. Can you get me busted? The mic is yours. Can you? I don't hear you. I think this guy here is stealing his Wi-Fi from his neighbor. That's what they do, the Muslims. That's why you have a very bad internet. How 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 somebody live in Houston? He have the most horrible internet like this. Obviously, he is using a free one. I don't hear you, Abdul. I don't hear you. Hello. Yeah, he's using yeah? he's using the neighbor's internet. I, I, can't do anything, I can't do anything about the about the uh, internet connection. No here. problem. Do you see? Uh, do you see the interpretation of the verse, my friend? Do you see the interpretation of the verse? It's in the front of you on the screen. Oh, I'm going to tell you. What I'm going to tell you is, it's best for you to go ahead. Don't and tell shut me. Things Don't down. tell me. No, I'm not going to shut down. I'm, I I shut Islam down. Tens of thousands of Muslims left Islam because of me. Tens of thousands, and you will leave Islam because of me. And this is why you are running away. Now answer. Does it say there that? You made me commit sin and you led me into error, yes or no? Why you lie to me? What he says, chapter, What chapter and verse are you talking this is the about? Verse you, I'm not even this is the this verse you quote for me. It's you who quote the verse for me. You forgot. It's you who quote this verse for me. I was quoting from Surah Baqarah. What's where, where are you quoting from? What Baqarah? Okay, what Baqarah told me this is a chapter 7, verse number 16. Are you saying to me that I'm, chapter? I, 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 let me tell you something. I haven't, I haven't been to chapter seven. I was in Surah Al Baqarah. Ah, okay. So, okay. In, in chapter seven, is telling us the story of Adam. So we are still in the topic. Shaitan told Allah before he kicked him out of heaven. Listen, listen. Before he kicked him out of heaven, he told him, "You are the one who caused me to commit sin." What do you say about that? What, what verse are you talking about? I told you. What's wrong with you? Are you deaf? Chapter 7, I, verse number 16. 
No, but do you hear me every time the internet breaks up? Are I you deaf when, I when told the, you, uh, I told you, I told up? you, I you know told what? you. You know what I would do? I would, I would, if we were in person, yeah. I would demand that you respect me. Okay? I don't respect you. I don't respect you. I don't respect anyone no, who believes. I don't respect, I don't respect you know, anyone who believes that he can beat his wife because he's a man. I don't and you that. are, no, you I are don't a Muslim. Believe in that. Quran teach that. Quran teach that. Don't, don't lie. I don't believe that. That's that's a lie and the deception from from Shaitan himself. Okay, read for me then. Chapter you're, four, verse number thirty-four. You're, 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 you're a liar. You are a liar. You are a liar. Okay, let me show everybody then. I am a liar, right? It, uh, see what you, what you're doing. You're going to every okay. single verse that you possibly can think of in order to divert. So you don't want to talk about this one. You no, just, you just uh, said I am lying. You liar. I want to show everybody who is lying you here. Don't want to talk, you it, don't want to talk about the the one in chapter it is, seven. It now is you want to no, we want to show. We want to show everybody. Your tactics. You know, this is one of your tactics. Want, you see through. You're transparent. You, you, know, you, you, you listen, you're listen, like Abdul, Abdul. Listen, Abdul. <laughs> you say this is a lie, and this is a from Shaitan. Do you want to talk about Adam, or do you want to talk about? Uh, Sperm. Do you want to talk about? We will talk about everything. I am here to get you. I am here to get you busted. I am here to get you busted, guys. Look with me. This is chapter four, verse number thirty-four. And this guy, he said, "I am lying." This is the translation of the Abdul, not my translation. I have nothing to do with it. As you see, this is search.com, which is what about chapter seven? What about chapter We will go back. We will go back. Let me get you busted. You said it's a lie. You so said you it's a lie, son of a muta. Listen carefully. Let me spank you and change your diaper because you smell so bad as a bambino. Listen carefully. It says, men are in charge of women because Allah has made one of them excel of others to others. So the men are excel of the women. And because they spend money or spend their property on them, who? Oh, the women. So because you spend money in the women, she's like a whore. So good women are obedient, guardian in secret that which Allah has guarded. As for those whom you fear, rebellion, admonish them and punish them and to beds apart and scourge them. Why you did lie and you said there is no such a thing in the Quran and you accuse me of lying. The mic is yours. Using you of convenience. Answer why you said it does not exist in the Quran, you liar. Why you say it's not? That, I didn't say that it didn't exist in the Quran. I'm saying that your understanding of what it's saying it is it says discourage them. It says discourage them. What does courage them mean? Unable, you are unable to comprehend what it's what is being said. And you are able to comprehend, correct? What okay. is a miswak? Do you know what a miswak is? No, I do not know. What is the miswak? Right. You don't know what a miswak is. No, I don't I never heard of it. What is that? It says strike them with a toothpick. Ooh. How much damage is a toothpick gonna prevent so, it to someone? So a miss okay, you, you, know you, you beat your okay. wife with the tooth brush, my friend. Yes, let me show you how stupid so you are. Let me show you how stupid you are. The miswak, so have, the miswak, your donkey is along a root of a tree. It is not the little tiny thing they said to you today. In the time of Muhammad, it was a cheap people, they get it from the ground. It's a flexible roots very harmful they beat the camel with it you idiot this is what the miswak is what miswak you see how stupid you are do you want me to show you the picture of the miswak are you stupid do you think it's really that little tiny piece of thing so you will teach your wife to how to behave by beating her by something in the in the size of one inch are you is, are you tickling her or you are beating her supposedly the verse is saying to teach them how to behave, not to tickle them. So who is the stupid here, Mr. Miswak? Now, do you want me to show you the size of the Miswak or the tree of the Miswak? Your mind. Give in and answer you. Do you want me to let show me you? Give in and answer. Do you want me to okay. show you the size of the Miswak? Let, do you want me? Let me, oh, let, let me. Let me submit. Let me answer you. Okay. How big the Miswak? How big the Miswak? You said the small, tiny thing. Let, let me answer you, okay? Uh -huh. You didn't even know what a miswalk was. Okay. But let me answer you. Mm -hmm. Let me answer you, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. It also says to invoke no pain on them, to leave no marks whatsoever on them. Oof. How do you how do you put your hands on someone and not harm them, not cause pain, and not leave any any mark? There is a book made by scholars <laughs> about. Let me let, let, me, uh, uh, let me get you busted. Let me get you busted. 
let me show you how stupid you are everybody will laugh in a second guys you should not leave a mark did you hear him saying that i want you to confirm that i, I want you to confirm i want you to confirm that that if you beat your wife you should not leave a mark is that correct You've long. I've studied the tafsir in Mishka University over that very surah right there. Which tafsir? Which tafsir? Which tafsir? Which 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 tafsir? Give me the name of the book. I will show it in the screen, and we will love together. Which tafsir? So I studied the tafsir in Mishka University. Shut up! Shut up! What do you mean? I studied tafsir in Mishka University. Give me the name of the tafsir, you idiot. What the tafsir? whole tafsir of Surah Ain Nisa? Yeah. What tafsir? Tafsir of who? Tafsir of who? Ibn Kathir, Al Qurtubi, Al Tabari, who? All of them. Okay. You understand that? All of them. Okay, shut up. Let me show the tafsir then. Here we go. All of them, guys. Did he say all of them? Did he say all of them? All right. Be happy. Here we go. I muted you. Don't talk. I will put it in the screen. Okay. Read with me, please. Don't beat them in the face. Turn your face for them, sorry, from the bed and discourage them in mild and exaggerating manner. Huh? Beat them. Don't exaggerate when you beat them. What does that mean? Let us see what does that mean. Oh, hold, hold on, hold on. Before I go and see what does that mean, let me get him busted more. Mujahid, 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 Mujahid. Nobody can hear you. Don't talk. Don't I'm talk. Not, hold on, hold on, hold on, Mujahid. Not, Mujahid. Did, I'm not, okay, let, let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Okay, let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. If a man, if a man come to to uh, the prophet and say to him, Abdul, uh, listen, listen. You are muted now because you keep talking. You do not hear me. I muted you. Don't talk. Don't talk. Are you there? Don't talk, don't, don't talk, don't talk, don't talk, don't talk, don't talk. Don't talk. Let me get you busted, Abdul. Let me get you busted. This is what I do here. I get Abdul busted. I don't know how many times. I, I don't know. Like you guys, you, you know, you, you, I think every inch of your body now have a needle already. Listen carefully. If a man come to you and he did beat his wife until her skin became a green, you will take the side of who? Where he go? He hang up. Let me call him back. I assure you, he is using a free internet of the neighbors. <laughs> He's un unavailable. <laughs> He's unavailable. <laughs> Just wait. I will, I will wait for him to call, and then I will get him busted again and again and again. You know, it's like gambling. You know gambling? Those people, the more they lose, the more they play. You know, you know the, the the madness of gambling. That's why he's calling back. He feel he is humiliated, and he tried to get back his honor. So he gambled more. You know. That's the whole idea. Like, there is not even one space in his body is not is not having a hole already. But this is what gambling do. Somebody saying you have you have a lot of uh, patient. You know what we what, what I do is really you need a lot of patience. Trust me, if you are in my place, you will go crazy from long time ago because you know that this is what it's mean, etc. But you have to treat them like a bunch of kids, for they are liars. Now maybe this guy is just an idiot who do not know what he's talking about, and obviously he is an idiot like the rest. But still, you have to trap them. You have to make them give the answer before you give the question, and that is hard how you can make him say something so he cannot take it back do you see what i do if you say to them right away something they will play around so you have to make it's like it's like a game you know and you have to be very smart you have to lead them into saying something and that thing they believe in it's not like you are the one making them say it okay what you believe but don't tell them yet what you are going to ask for. Tell me what you believe about, etc. And then he will talk and he will do poo poo. If you give him the question before the answer, the answer will change. This is how the Muslims are. They are not honest. They play games. And they knew 
they are followers of the devil. And I hope people here, they are learning really how to defeat Islam, not how to debate Muslims. Muslims don't debate. I never saw a Muslim debate anyone. They don't. You know, this is not a debate. This is a game. Call me back, Mujahid. If your free internet is still working and your neighbor did not turn off his Wi-Fi, call me back. <clears throat> I'm just giving him a chance to call me back. I hope his neighbor did not turn off the internet. Yeah, this is why his internet is weak. Like, do you think really somebody he lives in Houston, his internet is that horrible? It's not, it doesn't make sense. You know? Because if he's home, it's mean he have a he have a Wi-Fi. And if he is not home, he have he have a, a, a phone plan in his phone. I can show you the fatwa where a guy is asking, is it lawful? Is it halal? to uh, to uh, hook up an elect electric line so I can heat the water by electricity to do would do the shake he said it is not lawful for steel to steal however in this case it is halal like what the heck in this case it's halal in this case I hope you will call back now, man. We will be bored now. Man, I, I'm, I'm I'm glad I did not live in an apartment because if I live in an apartment, my neighbors will be bothered very much by the screaming, you know? Uh, yeah, yeah, I did not need to open it. I know what is there, you know, he's a liar. You see, I keep saying to him, okay, read for me what Michael Moore said, Michael Moore said. He did not answer. And when I showed him that his prophet said that uh, the sperm is gathered for 40 days, Michael Moore says that. He said, yes, it's a, you know, read. I, I told you what to read the answer. Read the book of <laughs> Michael Moore. What an idiot. Any Abdul? Do we have any Abdul here? Who is next? And when he called me, he said, you are shaking now. Honestly, I was really shaking. Very much. And he called himself Mujahid. You are right. <laughs> Read the tafsir. Which one? About what? No, no, I don't want to read the tafsir. I want him to call first and get him busted. You see, he said, I studied all the tafsir. And when I ask him which one, he don't want to tell me. All of them. I will get him busted again from the mouth of his prophet. <clears throat> Victor, no more. I don't know, actually, I need some water, but nobody here to serve me water. You see, I'm here sitting for this, uh, how many hours now? And I want to go to the kitchen, actually, and get some water. I'm really thirsty. Speaking all this time, it's not easy. Uh, he's a coward. Let him call back if he's a man, because I wanted him to read something, what, he, what his prophet he said about women beating and let us see then what he will say he did read all that of seer huh mm. are you sure you know if this guy really is a person who converted to islam it's not his fault this is the fault of his family his parents obviously they are not good family they did not take care of their child he is a victim of the stupidity muslims around him they did fool him but I believe today he made a good step by coming to me and he will leave Islam.
I challenge him. You are an insulting, ignorant individual. You, you interrupt me repeatedly, etc. Uh, yeah, I have to interrupt you. I ask you about uh, Adam. You talk about co uh, co coach. You are just a kid. You are the one who called me names. You are the one who said to me, "You are shaking." You are saying to me, uh, "You call me." From the first second you call me, you start insulting me. That is the truth. Now, as long he will not call again, let me get him busted about beating the women. Read carefully with me, guys, and laugh. A woman, she came to Muhammad, and her husband, he did beat her until her skin. He came greener than her clothes. What? Her skin became a greener than her clothes. Muhammad, he took. Don't, don't, don't block him, uh, uh, Christian by choice. Let uh, Kenny uh, Boomer please post. Let him post. Imagine, you know, put yourself in him in his shoes. This guy, he have bubbles everywhere now. Read carefully, guys. This is the prophet of the Abdul himself. This is not Tafsir. And this is the reason for the verse to come down to beat women. This woman was beaten by her husband until her skin became a greener than her clothes. And look what Aisha she said. Aisha she said that the lady came wearing a green veil, complained to her, Aisha, of her husband, and showed her green spots in her skin caused by beating it was a habit of ladies to support each other so when Allah messenger came I just said to him I have not seen any women suffering as much as a believing women why Muslim women are suffering that much she did not say as women she said believe in women specifically Muslim women, they are suffering very much. Suffering from what? Beating. What Muhammad did, the story is so clear. Aisha, she said, look, her skin is a greener than her clothes. Her skin is what? Is a greener than her clothes. Did Muhammad took the side of the women? No. Did he say to the man why you did that? No. Did he say to him, shame on you? I will punish you for beating your wife? No. Instead, he support the man. And the story is in the front of us. When Abdul Rahman heard that his wife had gone to the Prophet, he came with his two sons from another wife. She said, by Allah, I have, he said, by Allah, oh, sorry, she said, I have, uh, uh, by Allah, I have done no wrong to him. But he is impotent, which means he's, you know, like Muhammad, he cannot do bum bum. And he is useless to me as this, like her dress, she hold her dress. So this man, his penis is the same as a piece of fabric. The only way to move it is to turn the fan on. So obviously this man, she don't want him. And she hold a piece of her garment. Abdul Rahman said, by Allah, O Allah Messenger, she had told a lie. And very strong, which means his penis is very powerful and work very fine. And even he can break walnut with it. I am very strong and I can't satisfy her. But she is disobedient and want to go back to Rafa. What the heck? This is a good Muslim woman. She went to sleep with a different guy who is the previous husband. Allah Messenger said to her, if that is your intention, then you know that it's unlawful for you to remarry Rafa unless Abdul Rahman has sexual intercourse with you. <laughs> you see, guys, the beating is not the problem no more now. Muhammad, he did not even complain about the beating. He did not say why you beat her skin. Okay, so whatever is the problem, why you made her skin a green. And instead of that, he took the side of the man and he told her, okay, if you want to go back to the previous husband, your husband have to taste your juice. What the heck? 
What, what? Test what? You see here, they translate that enter he have intercourse with you. It doesn't say that in Arabic. It says, until he taste your juice. What a nice language, man. Hey, Mr. Brother Mujahid, what is the juice of the women you would like to taste? Can you please tell me what is the taste of a Muslim woman juice? What kind of juice she have? Where? Where is the juice? Where we can find the juice of a Muslim woman? I want to get some juice. I'm thirsty. Yeah, it says there. Hmm? Read with me. حتى يذوق من عسيلتك أو عسيلتك أنت هي تاست يور جوس ذا سويت جوس إز إت سويت هي مجهد إز إت ريلي سويت إف يو دونت بيليف مي باي ذا واي ليت مي ليت مي كوبي ذس هير وي جو ذا عربيك ها هولد أون أند أي ويل جو هير أي ويل سيرش فور ذا سيم حديث أند شو يو ديفرنت ترانسليشن أند ذن يو ويل سي هاو ذا مسلم ترين ذا ترانسليشن all right <clears throat> this is sahih al-bukhari that one was what that one was al-bukhari 25 this one is al-bukhari let us okay see this one <coughs> here we go look here how how the translation change no not until you taste his sweetness and he taste your sweetness <laughs> I'm so proud to be a Muslim. The Prophet of Allah told me that you cannot go back to your private, your, your previous husband unless you make the new husband taste your juice. Who is the Muslim when I tell me the sweetness? What is the taste? How, taste what? What is that? Is your wife is a watermelon? What is that, man? You Muslims, ah, I forgot there is a fatwa that you can. This is a fabricated hadith. Guys, do you see what do you see what I'm saying? This is a fabricated hadith. This is Sahih al-Bukhari. This is Sahih al-Bukhari. This is Sahih al-Bukhari. What fabricated hadith? Hadith number Sahih al-Bukhari 5825. Poor guy. I feel, I feel for you. You see, uh, listen, Ken. I really uh, don't I, I hope you will not be upset from me. I'm not against you, my friend. I feel sorry for you. That's all. They did lie to you. We are the Arab. We know how stupid this cult is. You do not know Arabic. You have no knowledge of Islam. And you are a victim. I have nothing against you. I believe you are a victim. I don't know you. You don't know me. You know? I wish you a good luck. But you are a victim. From Islamophobic website, guys, this is sunnah.com. This is sunnah.com. This is Islamophobic website. <laughs> this is sunnah.com. This is Islamic website. This is this is Islamophobia. Okay, hold on. Let us contact them. Contact us. Let us see where is contact them. Do they have a phone number? No. About. Let us see. Site objective. Our beloved Prophet Muhammad, Islamophobic website, they will say, Our beloved Prophet Muhammad. Guys, go to Christian Prince website and see how Christian Prince he says, From our beloved Prophet Muhammad. <laughs> this is a fair, this is Islamophobic website, obviously, because he's saying there, From our Prophet, beloved Prophet Muhammad. All those who they hate the Prophet, they say that, that he is our beloved Prophet. All right. I mean, this is this is amazing. All right. Uh, I don't know what to say. What do you think? Any more? What do you think? Do you think still really this is a? I mean, you know what? Why you don't search for the same hadith in your Islamic website? Forget about this website. Correct, guys? What do you think? We are showing the hadith number. Okay. This is Sahih al-Bukhari. Hadith number 5825. Go and search for it. 
who who said to you you need to read from this website my friend no don't read it from website i think actually i heard that this website is infected with aids i'm telling you this website have aids and some people they say it has diarrhea too even a smell but still that will not change anything we are giving you the hadith number Correct, guys. We are giving you the hadith number. You can go right now and search in any go by the book by Sahih al Bukhari. I agree with you. All Islamic books are fabricated and stupid. That's true. Yes, Mujahid, how are you? Hello. Yeah, I'm here. Can you? So, Mujahid, do you really believe that this is a fabricated website? Don't be honest. Are you going to let are, are you going to let me speak? Yeah, but I'm, I'm, I'm talking to you about what is in the, in the text. Do you really believe what you what you say? What I want you to do is I want you to stop and let me speak. Okay. Okay. You like to okay. Yourself can, talk. Can, can you do me a favor? Can you do me a favor? I want to go to the kitchen to grab some water. Don't talk until I come back because I want to hear you. I'm using headphone. I will not hear you. Is that okay? Is that fine? Go ahead. You're going to need some water. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. I will either. Should, by the way, in the Quran, it says that we can drink whiskey and black label. Is that is that okay if I bring whiskey? No, it's not okay to drink whiskey. No, Do it's you not. want me to show you from the Quran that it's okay to drink whiskey? You're not going to show me from the Quran that it's okay to drink whiskey. Do you want to challenge me? Go get you some water. You're Do you want to challenge me? I forgot about the water. I want the whiskey now. Do you want to challenge me about that? Let me tell you something. No, no, no don't in you Islam, talk about do you Islam, want me, in Islam, do you want to challenge me? Do you want to do you want to challenge me? We're not allowed to consume alcohol. Do you want to You're challenge me? Okay, challenge Islam, me. Okay, why you don't challenge me? Okay, why you don't challenge me, my friend? Challenge me. Let us what make I'm a challenge. I'm going to tell you is you're not going to find anything in the Quran that that says that it's okay to consume alcohol. Are you sure? Nothing of any kind, Are you, I'm are, you are you sure? I'm absolutely certain about that. Okay, read, read with me this verse then. Go get, go get yourself some water. No, no, no. I don't want to get whiskey now. You know, because the Quran, the Quran, the Quran. I'm very nervous. I'm very nervous. I called the address. I called the address. Okay, read for me. Read for me. Read for me. Read for me. You said there's nowhere in the Quran. You said there's nowhere in the Quran it says that alcohol Lower is good for voice, you to I'm drink. Hang up. Lower okay. your voice. I'm going to hang up. If you talk to me with disrespect. I'm gonna hang up. I'm if talking you call to me uh, any name. I don't. I up. don't care if you hang if up. You don't. Don't threaten me, my friend. Yeah, don't you, do. me. you was begging for me to get back on. Because no, I'm, I'm, I'm not begging for you. I'm trying to save you. I'm trying to save you. You are ignorant. You are a victim. Yeah. Honestly, honestly, Mujahid, I don't hate you, man. I have nothing against you. You are a I, victim. I don't, I'll be honest. I don't care if you hate me or you don't hate me. I, I don't. don't. No, I don't. No. Now read with me. Okay, okay. Let us cut the crap out. Chapter sixteen, verse chapter. Chapter 16, verse number 67. I challenge you to read it. You said there's nowhere in the Quran it says you are allowed to consume alcohol. Chapter 16, verse number 76, and the mic is yours. I don't know what you What do you mean to know what I'm talking about? I just give you the verse. I didn't say that you talk about. It. I said I don't know what you said. I said in chapter 16, verse number 67, Allah said it is good for you to have alcohol even it's good to use it as to drink with it and to get a drunk and to make even money from it which means to buy it to say to drink it and to get a drunk no, with it no it doesn't say that it says that read it for me go ahead no it doesn't say that it, it says, doesn't say that. okay read for me okay what what chapter verse 16 or what 67 <laughs> okay oh man <laughs> you know it's it's really a shame that you people are on the same bandwagon and you're unable to simply comprehend very simple and basic i know you see we are the arab who speak arabic we still we cannot comprehend but you are the one who don't know one arabic word you can comprehend i mean that's amazing well different intellects have different levels of comprehension right and, right and, right this is why the child who is right. have no sin he went to hell right and you are the one who told me it does not make sense but now it makes sense Right, so if a hadith doesn't make sense, we don't live by that. No, you live, live by it because this is a sahih hadith. 
Right. We don't have to follow all the hadith. You, you, have, to, you have to. You have to. Okay. To what if I get you busted? What if I get you busted? What if I get you busted that you have to follow hadith all the hadith of Muhammad? And you listen to what I'm telling you. No, if it's you not up to you. I don't shut up. Nobody tell me shut up. Even my mom, she never said to me shut up. Because she said your voice is beautiful. Sing for us. And since I was a baby, I keep singing Quran since the first day. Like my mom, she gave birth to me. I was saying like, and right away she said, this guy is going to up in a chat room to shut up every Muslim who recite Quran because he do it better than them. Now answer, you idiot. The verse in the front of me, chapter 16, verse number 68 says, it is lawful for you. It is allowed for you to use alcohol, to drink and get it drunk, and even to make money from it. Why you are saying to me, I don't comprehend, and you comprehend. What about right now we go and read the interpretation for the verse the mic is yours? Well, I'll tell you what, don't interrupt me again, okay? What about we and go I'm and read the interpretation? I'm going to repeat this. 1.8 billion Muslims in the world, you haven't shut anybody. You, you made me fart. You're making a foolish claim. Yes, let me ask you, is the Shia Muslims? What about it? Is the Shia Muslims? Well, sure they are. They are? The Shia Muslims? What, what they, do you mean? Are, they, mean? are they Muslims? The Shia, are they Muslims? Well, sure they are. But they worship it's Ali. They say Ali is the light of Allah. It's, it's not for me to say, no, they don't worship Ali. Yes. And they, and, and no, they, they don't. And they believe that Muhammad is made from light. Look, brother, you, you, don't, you don't make false claims because of okay. Allah's do you, do you want to challenge me? Do you want to challenge me? You do not know anything. Everything I say, it's it, it, it turned to be true. But and you're I making give, a, you're, and making, you're lying. Everything I say, I, it turned to be true, and I give a proof. Now, let us go back, and we can go back to the Shia. You are a, you are a Sunni, right? Are you Shia or a Sunni? I'm Sunni. Okay, We're that's not. good. Okay. The, the Sunni, they say that the Shia are not Muslims. So stop lying. I can show you tons of videos in YouTube no, saying no, Shia no, will no, go to hell. No, let me tell you something. A Muslim is not allowed to say who is or his, who is not. No, a he's allowed. You're That's a liar. Let me show you. Let me get you busted. The Muslim, no, the Muslim is allowed. The Muslim is allowed. And your prophet, he did no, that too. The Muslim is not allowed. No. You don't, you're not a Muslim. You don't know. Okay. I, a Muslim is not allowed to say who is or who is not a Muslim. Are you that sure? To decide. Are you, you sure? That? Are you sure? So why your prophet he said the I'm, following in front I'm of your eyes? So sure. why your prophet he said my nation will split to 73, 73 sect and one of them only will get right. to hell. Also her. before that, guess what? He yeah. said the Jewish people were split into seventy two sects. Okay. The Christians no, excuse me, the, the Jews were split into seventy one. All right. The, the Christians were split into seventy two sects. Did mm -hmm. you know that? Yeah, that's absolutely but that's mean that you, you must have okay hold on hold on hold on hold on that's mean the most lost people are the muslims because they are the ones no. who split 73. Let, let me no that's not that's not what that means yes that's not that hold on hold on guys guys did this guy he said do you know he is the one who said that do you know that the jews split into 70 to 71 do you know that the christian they split into 72 but the verse the hadith says that the muslims split into 73 so the most deceived people is not the Jews, not the Christians, the Muslims. The mic is yours. You're you're bouncing around. You're just simply. I'm not. Fool. You are the one who said true. that. You are the one who. You are the one. Who, you are the. What verse? Chapter seventeen. What verse? Why you change the topic now? Do you want to talk about seventy-three split? Why the Muslims are? Why the Muslims are more deceived? Why the Muslims are more deceived than the Christians and the Jews? Explain to me why the Muslims are seventy-three. Why the Jews are seventy-one? Why you are the worst? Because there's going to be more Christian, I mean, Muslims in the world before the day of judgment than any other it's, religion. It's, it's still, we're not That's making a difference because it's still you are 73 to 1. Doesn't make any difference. Yeah. Who cares if they are 10 people who they are deceived or 20 or 1 million? So you are saying to me, you are saying to me, the world will become majority Muslims and 72% of them are going to go. So, sorry, 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 guys. From, from every, hold on, hold on. Let us see how, how stupid this joke is. From every 73 Muslims, there's 72 will go to hell. One will go to heaven. Play card is better. There's no guarantee. That's not what it says. This is what it says. No, and it not only that, no, it not only that, did your prophet say that Islam start as a strange, small, and will end as a strange and small? No. Didn't, do you want, do you want to challenge me? Happened? Do you want to challenge me? Do you, gonna talk about do you want to challenge up, me? Do you want to challenge me? 
that he said. So I, I want to challenge you to a live control debate. Are you man enough to do that? You are the one who no. opened the topic. You I, see, that's, okay. this is stupid of you. It, it is, so it, shut up. Don't tell me Islam is the, the whole world will become Muslim because that will prove that Muhammad is a false prophet. For Muhammad, he said Islam start as a small, tiny religion and will end as a small, strange, tiny religion. So why you are saying something against your prophet of prophecy? True believers versus those who call themselves Muslim. There's the Muqmin, ah, which are the true believers. They call themselves Muslims, but Muhammad, he said that those who call themselves Muslims and they are true Muslims, are going to be the minority, not the majority. Right. True mukmin, the mukminin and the mukmina, the mukmin, absolutely, the mukmin, uh -huh. the true believers. Uh -huh. That's for, absolutely. So you okay, take, let, okay, let, let us go. Okay, hold on, hold on. So the child, the child, the idiot, idiot, idiot. How how a true believer can be true believer if a child he did not commit no sin and he is born as a Muslim? Because your prophet said every person is born as a Muslim, he will go to hell. How the mukminin they will go to heaven or they will go to hell? If the child is going to hell, once again, you're bouncing around. I'm not topics. bouncing around, I'm getting you busted. I'm spanking you. A child who never commits sin, how he will go to heaven. How your Quran says, if you believe in Allah, you go to hell, you go to heaven, and the child, according to Muhammad, is born as a Muslim, which means he believes in Allah already. He's a Muslim, so how he will go to hell? Go ahead and keep running. How he will go to answer? Did your prophet say everyone is born as a Muslim? Did he say that? Everyone, every child is born as a Muslim. Did he say that? So, admit, admit, I do. You. Just shut up. I have no time for kids. Don't call me again. Go, go to hell. Let the hell of Muhammad take you. Let the hell of Muhammad take you. I did my part. You are a follower of the devil. You don't want people to help you. The Quran not only, not only approve alcohol. The Muslims used to pray and they are drunk. And the coward Muhammad, according to Muslims, Muhammad, he forbid things in steps. That's false. Muhammad, he forbid alcohol when he got sick. He cannot drink no more. The Quran says that the Muslims, they pray and they are drunk. I wish I have a video camera at that time. I Honestly, honestly I wish I have a camera with me. يا أيها الذين آمنوا لا تقربوا الصلاة وأنتم سكارى. Oh, you believe? Don't approach prayer and you are. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم شيش كباب فلافل آمين. What it does mean? Don't approach not to pray when you are totally drunk and high high five five. What does that mean? Do you know? I get disconnected, so I don't know. I don't know what you've been saying. The okay, last the Quran says, seconds. "Don't approach the prayer when you are drunk." What does that mean? Okay, l l this is real simple. Okay, mm. let me explain it to you. I'm uh. going to need thirty seconds to explain this to you. Okay, uh -huh. Uh -huh. are you going to give me thirty seconds? I this would, is really, I, I really will give you simple. three sec thirty second and one beer, no problem. Right. This is very, very simple. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. So this is what's called an abrogation. Okay, now th listen to what I'm going to tell you. Mm. In the in the days of Jahiliyyah, the mm. days of ignorance, alcoholism was very, very rampant. It was very bad. Oof. Okay, right. So, mm -hmm. by, uh, man, okay. So initially, in the early days of Islam, people were still consuming alcohol until the day that a man came to prayer and he was leading the prayer and he stumbled through the prayer because he was intoxicated. Mm -hmm. And so because he, because he was intoxicated, uh -huh. he drank too much. Then it was revealed that, that you do not come to the prayer in, in a state of, of drunkenness. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then that was abrogated. That was to allow man. It's like uh, trying to come off of a drug or al alcohol. All right. You have to be, you have but, to, but you he have said, to be, but uh, he said, but he said, let me, let me finish my 30 seconds is enough. But he did not say don't drink. He said, don't, but, don't pray when you are drunk. That's all. Right. Let me, let me explain to you. Give uh -huh. me my full 30 seconds. Okay. This is really simple. It's finished. Uh, you, uh, you, you, are, you are answering for those more two, two minutes. What do you think 30 seconds? Right. So now I haven't spoken for 30, 30 seconds okay. because you interrupted me. Count, count, count your time. Count. Should, should so, I? Should initially, I put a clock for initially you? they mm -hmm. were still drinking in the early days of Islam. Uh, and okay, your, and your prophet, he had no problem with that. Then and, it was abrogated. And why your prophet? Why you? Why you? No one okay, what is that? What is the abrogation? Let me explain. 
Let me explain it to you. What is the if abrogation? you want to hear it, let me explain it to you. It's abrogated where? Let, it's an abrogation. Where? Okay, listen to what I'm telling you. Okay, why? You're going to have to shut Where, where is the abrogation? I see in the front of me, chapter 16, right. verse number 67, which is given That's after this right. verse. It says so have, that to me. You're going to have to stop and listen my friend, if let, you want Hold to on, hold on. Let, let me read for you this chapter, chapter 16, verse number 67. It says. From the black label and whiskey, you can make a good drink and you get drunk with it and make good money and sell it in any shop or a store or even Starbucks. Did you see the verse in the front of your eyes? Chapter 16, verse number 67. If the alcohol was bad and it's known to be bad to Allah, why he is encouraging you to buy it, to sell it, to drink it? Let, let me explain to you, and you cannot ans ask me a question and answer, not give me an answer. answer. Why he is encouraging you to buy it, to make it, to drink it, I'm to get a drunk you. with it, and to make money from it? I'm going to answer your first question, and then I'll answer another. This is question. my first question. Yep. This is the first verse I gave you, Abdul. This is the first verse I gave you, chapter 16, yep. verse number 67. You forgot? You hang I'm, up on me. You hang I'm, up on me. You did not answer yet. I'm chapter six. You. You chap connected. Abdul, chapter sixteen, verse number sixty-seven. Why Allah no. is encouraging you to Let buy it, something. to make it, to sell it, to drink it, and get it drunk with it? What can is that? Is that a commercial promotion? Allah making Let commercial me. for alcohol. What you're doing is making an absolute fool of yourself. Okay, let people laugh at me or at you. No problem. I have no problem. People are recording this and people are laughing either at you or at me. Why Allah you're encouraging not. people then? Why people are encouraging them, and he is a praising making alcohol, praising it. He said, Let me what is you, the has, do you, answer. Do you know Shall what? I? Okay, go ahead. Let, you want me to give you an answer about chapter okay. 16? Listen, about the chapter 16, verse number 67, if, please. If, if you interrupt me one more time, yeah, what you no, I'm, not, I'm just gonna hang what you I'm not gonna waste my time. You, with you, foolishness. I okay. know what you would do. You if, make, I, if I interrupt you one more time, you are going to drink camel urine, as the prophet he said. Correct, this is what you do. Camel urine, you're doing camel urine. That's what I know. I will go if you interrupt the moment. I will go and drink beer. If I interrupt you one, one time, you go and drink camel urine. Do you want to make challenge? What kind of religion ordering you to quit drinking alcohol but to drink camel urine? You know, that's a really stupid. stupid what do you mean, stupid? Did your prophet order you to drink camel urine? So, here we no. go. Don't drink, don't drink beer, but drink camel urine. So you exchange two yellow liquid. The yellow liquid of the beer is bad. The the, the are you the, changing the subject? I'm not Just changing like the topic. I answer, answer, answer. Oh, answer. Chapter oh, sixteen. Chapter sixteen. Chapter sixteen. Chapter sixteen. Verse number sixty-seven. I'm listening. Yesterday you raped a child and you robbed a bank, and I caught you. And let's talk about that. Why did you rob the bank yesterday? Uh, what what what? Because I why because. You did it. Why, why did you need the money? Yesterday, why did you need the money? Yesterday, I was a Muslim. It's halal right. to rob a Christian bank. Okay. Don't you know? Do you want to show you the that's, reference? Do you want me to show you the reference that it is lawful? Do you want me to show you? Do you want me to show you that it is lawful to rob a bank if you are a Muslim robbing non-Muslim bank? Do you want me to show you that? Oh my goodness gracious! Do you want me to show you that, you idiot? You know what? The do you want me to show you that? You, you, why you are changing the topic? Do you want me to show you that it's allowed for you? It's allowed. It's allowed for you. It's allowed for you to kidnap Muslim Christian women. It's allowed for you to rob Christians. So you are a bank robber. You far. You, you liar. Shame on you to lie. You liar. Shame on you. What kind of mother you have? Did not teach you a good manner. You don't even know my name, you filthy liar. You don't know even how I look like, you filthy liar. What rubber bank, you stupid liar? What a donkey you are. But I forgive you because I love donkeys. Now, answer us. Chapter 16, verse number 67. Why Allah saying it is good to drink alcohol and get it drunk and to sell it and to buy it and make good money from it. The mic is yours. It wouldn't come out of your mouth or out of your face. Answer why why Allah promote why Allah promoting black label whiskey? Answer why he is promoting in chapter 16, verse number 67, to make it, to buy it, to drink it, and to make good money from it. The mic is yours. Let me tell you something. Tell me okay. something. Tell me something. You want to tell me something or you tell me an answer? I want the answer, not something. Give me the answer. Why Allah he asking you to promote a black label? Listen, Abdul, don't waste my time. I have tons of Abdul waiting for me. I grow them in my backyard. You think yeah, you, are you don't the have only? any like do you think you are the only Abdul I got here? Are you serious? Come on. So now 
chapter no, 16 chap chapter 16 you. stop laughing at islam my friend this is shame don't laugh chapter 16 verse number 67 allah promoting black label encouraging you to make it to buy it to sit and to drink the drunk with it and to praise it and to enjoy it why is that if alcohol is bad okay let me explain to you why uh -huh. you're gonna listen for 30 seconds okay, I'm it's listening. Because all right because I'm, listen. I'm listening the was revealed long before <laughs> the prohibition of intoxicants uh -huh. okay okay however by using the phrase good in the verses, it's talking about wholesome nourishment after the intoxicants. Oof. The fact that the intoxicant is not good. Uh, I don't, I don't hear you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't hear you. I don't hear you. It says there clearly that it causes you to be drunk and that is good for you, my friend. What horse? What, what? That's not what it's saying. This, I'm going to repeat again. This is the what verse it says. revealed long before prohibition of our intoxicants. Okay, doesn't matter. However, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. However, Why he's saying it's good to however, be drunk? Why it says it's good to be... Why? You want the answer? No, no. I don't want the answer. I'm here to play you, to make fun of you. You are an idiot. It says, because I know you will have no answer. You are trying just to defend, not to answer. You have no answer. It says... Here, read with me carefully. Ah, oh, sorry, I forgot you are illiterate like your prophet. Tattakhiduna minhu sakaran, sakaran. You take from it a drink, make you drunk. What is a qan hasanan and make you make good money from it? So he is praising, saying that from it you get a drunk and that make you even have more money. So your prophet, God, or Muhammad, aka Allah. Is encouraging you to get a drunk and he is speaking about the good of the drunk the alcohol he is not speaking about anything what is a con hasana he did not say and from the fruits of the palm tree and the grape you enjoy juice no he said from it you make a liquid which make you drunk and hold some good things for you and he is a praising and he is saying this is a miracle in the this is a miracle for people who understand so do you understand the mic is yours okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to read to you the commentary out of the quran uh -huh. and it's a translation by ali unal you ready who who, who is the one ali unal this one ready okay but the no 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 don't, no 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 don't interrupt me. no 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 i want to read with you no hold on hold on I'm, it's not fair my friend you need to tell me this commentary is made by who who is the scholar speaking there i said ali unal i already who said is, that who is ali this guy unal. who is this guy i never heard of this guy who, uh, is, is he something new uh no it's okay absolutely where, not where we can find ali unal. Ali what? I never heard of this guy. Uh, what he... it up. Ali Unal, U-N-A-L. I don't give a crap if you've heard about him or not. If that's irrelevant. Okay, can you give, me, I'm gonna, can you give me a link? Okay, can yeah. you do me a favor? Can you give me a link for the, for the so we can put it in the screen so everybody can read it? I don't it have a link. I'm, I'm holding the Quran in my hand. Okay, where, where we can find a link? Can you find me a link? You find a link. I'm not on the no. internet. Okay, I have... no, hold on. Hold on. You are in the internet, you liar. What do you mean you are in the internet? You are speaking to me in the internet and you are not in the internet. I mean, do you see how much they lie? Aren't you using the internet now to call me? What do you mean you are not in the internet? Aren't you using I Skype? I am not on the internet. You are I'm using on Skype. The phone speaking to you. You idiot. You can find a link in the phone. The phone have internet. That's why you are calling me in Skype. The Skype is internet. I'm not. I'm not. Well, I want to read. I want to read with you. I want to read because I want to learn. No, 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 no. Uh, okay, can you type for me the name in the screen, please, in the chat? Can you type the name for me so I can find the? Uh... Look, you know how to spell the word Ali. The name Ali. I know. A -L -I. Ali. Yeah. What is the second? What is the second? U N A L. Look it up. Okay. 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 Somebody Look post. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me find. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Let me. Let me find uh, uh, this guy interpretation for the Quran. Hold on. Ali on ah, this is a Turkish guy. Is he a Turkish it doesn't guy? Matter who he, is. he doesn't he doesn't speak Arabic. Oh man, come on. You don't know what he <laughs> speaks or what he doesn't speak. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> okay. Let me let me let me open his uh, page so I can place in the Quran before you start reading. Hold give me hold all your sources. Okay. Well, what's, what's the purpose of no. the point is the point it? is we wanna we wanna laugh because I will show you that even the one you are to make you look yeah, you fool. Got, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me say, 
As for those who disbelieve, it matters not whether you warn them or do not warn them. They will not believe. Allah has set a seal over their hearts and over their hearing and over their eyes as a veil. And pain will be the penalty that they incur. And that is you, unfortunately. What is that? What, what so the verse, it says the verse was revealed long before prohibition of intoxicants. <laughs> However, by using the phrase of good, uh -huh. wholesome nourishment after intoxicants, the fact is that intoxicant is not good. Uh, wholesome, no, and it's saying that wholesome nourishment is implied. Coming after the verse describing milk and how it is produced, the Quran refers to intoxicants in correspondence to excrement and blood. While the phrase good, wholesome nourishment corresponds to milk, thereby preparing the minds for the prohibition of intoxicants by calling on people to use their reason concerning their matter. It encourages them to think and to be sensible and reasonable when choosing their food and their drink. Do you understand what it's telling you? No. It's saying those same fruits, those same fruits that were used to create the, mm -hmm. the intoxicant, the mm -hmm. fruit itself is good. You can have that. Okay. And what you're about... Not have, you're not going to have the intoxicant. Who, who, if, okay. If, okay. If, okay. Hold, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me get, let me get you busted. Oh, okay. Okay. Let me get you busted. Hold on. Hold on. Let me, let me get you busted. Say, no, hold on. This guy... Hold on. This guy... You is, don't want the uh, let you. me get you busted. Let me get you busted. Hold on. Let us, let us do this. This is the Quran in the front of us. 16. 67, my friend. I don't go by a bunch of idiots we never heard of. A person is not even an Arab. We are the Arab. We are the Arab. Read carefully. Guys, this is Tafsir Ibn Abbas. Who is Ibn Abbas? This is the cousin of the Prophet. Ooh, ooh, oh, this is a big guy. This is the cousin of Muhammad. Alayhi salatu wassalam. Uh, uh, listen, Mujahid. Do you think Mujahid know better than Ibn Abbas, the cousin of the Prophet? What do you think? Are you there? Hello? Hello? As you see, none of what you said is located here. Allah praising, making alcohol. I don't know what happened to this guy. Are you there? <clears throat> Maybe his neighbor turned off the free Wi-Fi. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Guys, does it say here? <clears throat> this is this is say there, this is before before the, 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 the wine and alcohol became forbidden. So Allah, he was praising it. None of what he said is exist here. Uh, they expose the lies of Muhammad and uh, learn how to be tough on this cult. And tough mean to be bold, to say it as it is, not as they want, not perfectly correct. Being perfectly, perfectly correct is an illness, is a weakness. If somebody is hiding something, they've been forced to say something. So if you are a Christian, say things as it is. Yes, we love the Muslims, but doesn't mean we will let the Muslim die and go to hell. Loving the Muslims is saving the Muslims. It's not the opposite. So when somebody, he says to you, uh, that you are being rude, this is not how a Christian should be speaking. A true Christian is the one who says things as it is, and that will make it truth for sure.